Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. We're back. We're back. It's Tuesday. It's a new week. And I'm actually live on a Tuesday for once. I mean, I usually- I'm supposed to, but I feel like I've cancelled Tuesday streams for at least two weeks now. So, it's nice. It's nice to be back on Tuesday. <laughs> hey, Craig. Craig is today's first. And Chris is today's second. How are you doing today? How are you doing? Tuesday. Yeah, I actually work today. Um... I actually worked today because I was not feeling good yesterday, so I had to go into work today instead. So it's been, um, well, it hasn't been as long of a day as it should have been because uh, I didn't have any work left to do after, like, well, when lunch uh, started, I, I could just leave because there was nothing else for me to do. <laughs> I won't have anything more to do until tomorrow because no one is at the office on on Tuesdays. So, so that how it be. Managed to do some some shopping and stuff though for stuff little things that I needed. Um, <laughs> uh, how am I been? I've been um, I've I've been. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> no, I um, I just haven't been feeling too good. But it's 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 not too bad. It's not too bad now. How are you though? How are you though? I feel like I haven't like seen anyone in so long. Even though I have, it's only been since Saturday, but at the same time, I feel like, I don't know. I, I feel like I, I'm just in my own little bubble these days. <laughs> uh, but also something, something uh, fun. I mean, I know it was kind of like, out of the blue, but at the same time not. But uh, we're gonna have the movie night on Sunday, and then we're gonna have a movie night for the next three Sundays because we're gonna watch Lord of the Rings, uh, which I've been wanting to do with with all you guys for for a while. Um, and we were gonna have a movie night for um, well, it was one of the incentives for the. Veprithon on my birthday, so so we are gonna do that on Sunday, and then I figured, you know, because I've had you guys, I made you guys wait for a while, so having three movie nights seems seems seems, you know, seems fair. <laughs> seems fair. Also, it feels wrong to just pick one of the movies because if you gotta watch one, you gotta watch all of them, you know. You gotta watch all of them. Hope I'm doing better now. Thank you. I mean, I, I am today. Today I'm better. Hey, Daniel. Don't, 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 don't say that. We don't need to know that. <laughs> Are you at work? Well, I don't know if that's better or worse, but... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if that's better or worse, but... But yeah, so today we're gonna be playing Snufkin because... I started playing this on on um, well when, when when we had the cozy raid train with CKT, so we have played it once on stream, as in like one day, but like we we, we didn't finish it or anything. So we're gonna continue playing that today. We are gonna continue that today. Um. The apprentice soaked you with water. She's dead to you. Oh, well, maybe, maybe she thought you were hot. I don't know. Maybe she, she, she thought you needed it. I don't know. I don't know. Discord has great choice. <laughs> well, I mean, to be fair, I, I made the choice, but I feel like people, there were more people that suggested that than anything else. I figured that would be fair. But... Sunday is usually the, the only day during the week that I can do it where other people can also join in. Because other otherwise it would be on 
Thursday? And Thursday is not a good day for uh, movie nights <laughs> when you have so many different time zones. Um, so Sunday is the only day during the weekend that I can do it. So uh, I figured. Yeah. So if you want to join in, uh, it's going to be at 6 uh, p.m. CEST on Sunday for the next three Sundays starting this week. If you want to join in, if you want to join in. Save? I can't save now. <laughs> hey, Palm! Today's third. How you doing, Palm? Great choice, great taste. Mm. <laughs> Good. Hey, I feel that. I feel that. It happens. You feeling better? Thank you. I appreciate that. You be lurking, gonna try to be productive? Do it. Do it. Be, be productive. Do all, do all the things. Do all the things today. <laughs> There's 91% chance Zot will beat Dadman in combat. That's actually kind of embarrassing. <laughs> Chris. <laughs> Wait, are you not gonna... Wait, you need to finish uh, Hollow Knight, Chris. <laughs> what movies are we watching? We were gonna watch uh, Lord, of the, uh, Lord, of the, Lord of the Rings. Jesus Christ, I can't, I can't uh, say the word, the name. Lord of the Rings, we're gonna start watching the first one on Sunday. Um, hope this email finds you. <laughs> this time it was only find you. That, that, that's, that's a threat if I've heard any threats in my entire life. Which I might have. <laughs> and are we 100%ing it with Sylvia? No. Well, I mean, Palm, you can, you can, as I said in the announcements, if you want to host anything by yourself, feel free to do so. I'm not gonna do that though, but you can do it if you want to. Um... <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, okay, I, I literally said that right before seeing the next message that you just said. But you can host a special screening after seeing the trilogy. You can do that, yeah, sure, go ahead. <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> You can't finish Hollow Knight. Zod keeps beating him. Mm. I mean, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> Soviet Lord of the Rings. I... I'm like, I'm... I'm curious. I I wanna I wanna I wonder what that would be like. I still haven't watched any of those. I haven't even watched the the animated Lord of the Rings. I just I just feel like it's um, I don't know. <laughs> Is it Kronitelli? Wait, hold. I, I I spat that out literally. Um. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> She's spitting. Yeah, I am. I am. Uh, it do be happening sometimes. Mm. But yeah, so today we're gonna we're gonna be cozy. We're gonna be wa uh, watching. Well, you guys will be watching. I will be playing Snufkin. Um, I've been wanting to get back into it, but um, I've decided that Tuesday is gonna be. Like, a day for, for any other game than Baldur's Gate 3, at least until I'm done with this playthrough of Baldur's Gate. Uh, and I have plans, I, like, I have ideas for what I want to do after that as well. Like, obviously I want to keep playing more Baldur's Gate, but I feel like... I have a feeling that most people are getting sick of my streams because my streams are doing so much worse uh, than they have in a long time now. And I think it's just because people are really bored of Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, which makes me sad, but I, I'm i not really trying to pander to what everyone else wants either, so I'm just keep doing what I'm doing. Um, I'm just gonna be doing what I'm doing uh, until I'm not doing it anymore. <laughs> uh, might be just general interest in the game. 
Hmm. Well. I don't know. I don't know. I, wait, what do you mean by that, actually? I, I'm not really sure. Um. Because... I don't know. But either way, the, the thing is, I can't f force myself to play something that I don't feel like playing just because I know it's going to do better on stream. I know a lot of people do that and a lot of people feel like they have to do that. Most people feel like they have to do that, I think. Um, and I just don't want to do that. I, I don't want to be that kind of stream that I, I just do whatever I think that everyone else wants me to do. Because then it would be kind of fake. <laughs> like I'm not trying to do anything. Like I'm I'm just being here, um, streaming what I want to stream. You know. And of course, we do have votes for games that I like. People might want me to play and stuff, but that is mostly when I can't decide. Like if I really want to play something, I will do it. Um. But then if there are different alternatives and I can't really choose because I want to play all of them, then we tend to have a vote. Um, like the interest of the game overall has gone down, not just web specific streams. Oh, I see. I don't really know if that's true, though. Um, no, honestly, I think it's a lot of different things. I think it's more a me, me issue as well, because... Uh, my streams are probably not that fun anymore because I have been a little bit more down lately, so I'm not really... I don't have a lot of... I don't know. I, I just feel like my streams aren't really that entertaining <laughs> because of my mental state nowadays, but... But I, I could be wrong. I don't know. Um... In one and a half month, the Elden Ring DLC is out, though. That'll give you some joy. Well, I'm, I'm not sure if I will be playing it on release, because I feel like I need to play the entire game again. <laughs> uh, and I don't know if I... I, I don't have... The, 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 the want to do that. I don't know if I want to, to, to play that again. Um, and I've heard that to be able to play the DLC, you have to beat all the... All the bosses. Like, all the the main bosses. Even the ones that are... Like, the, the story bosses that aren't... Necessary to beat the game as well. Like, Melania and all that stuff. So you have to do all the side stuff too. You can't just... You can't just beat the game. And then... You know... But we'll see, though. We'll see. Uh, and I also feel like a lot of people will be playing it as well, so it's like... Then one out of two things will happen. Um, or both things will happen. On stream, there will be so many people playing it that you will just be drowned out and no one will find your stream. Because just everyone will be playing it. And the second thing is that a lot of people will say, Oh, I don't want to- I, I don't want to get spoiled, so I can't hang out. So people won't be in your stream either because they don't want to get spoiled. So I think it's the best thing for me to just wait um, because I am also not feeling like playing it uh, that soon. I was I, like I'm excited for it, but I can wait. Um, I can wait. Wait, why are you saying sorry? You don't have to say sorry. I'm just I'm just answering you. <laughs> I'm not I'm not. You don't have to say sorry. <laughs> But yeah. No, it's not a bad suggestion. I, I was considering it and I wanted to, but I... I just feel like I need to play the whole game before I can do that. And I'm... I just finished it in December. <laughs> with uh, with uh, Rods and Chris and, and Pickley. So... I feel like... I need to wait a little bit longer until I play it again. It's not a game that I can play that often, I don't think, because... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But we'll see, though. Maybe I will change my mind 
Um, who knows? But there are other things, though. A lot of other games that I'm going to be playing and that I want to play. Uh, and I know that this is something that you might not be too happy about, Paul. <laughs> I know that this is something you might not be happy about, but um, I ho also have been... Um, I've been missing The Witcher 3 as well. <laughs> and if if I will will be playing that again on stream, it's I'm not going to be playing Gwent that much though. So don't worry. Um <clears throat> but I have I have been wanting that too because I haven't played it at all since they made the big uh, update to the game. And they're also going to release a they they made an announcement today, I think. Hold on, let me see. Um, an extensive mod editor. So that means there will be a lot of new mods and stuff too. And that will be uh, available on May 21st. But yeah, it's not something that's going to happen like within the next few weeks or anything. It's just something that I'm considering. I don't know if I'm going to be diving into a, a really long game after Baldur's Gate 3 again. We'll see. I don't I don't really have a lot of plans. <laughs> we'll take it as it comes. You know, we'll, we'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. Uh, Baranta's Crab Game looks like a great short refreshing game though. Wait, is it short? It looks cute though. I have uh, I have seen some other people play it as well and it does it does look cute. Um, yeah, I don't know how long is how long it is, but we could give it a go. We could give it a go. Mod for TV show Jennifer. <laughs> you like you like TV show Jennifer more than more than uh, in game Jennifer. I have to say. My my last playthrough that I did on stream, I didn't romance anyone because I don't like any of them. <laughs> I genuinely do not like any of them. <laughs> um I they're they're all awful. All sorceresses in, in the Witcher universe are just terrible. They're all terrible. So I don't know if this is considered a spoiler. I don't know. Um but it's if you don't end up romancing any of them at the end of the game well this is the DLC ending um like the one you romanced will come to to your your house and you know but if you don't romance any of them you will get Siri to visit you instead and that is much better because I love Siri Siri's the best one so I I would rather not romance anyone and have Siri show up than have any of them. <laughs> um, you don't have to romance anyone. Yeah, I didn't I didn't do that on my last playthrough. I've had three playthroughs of the game. First one I romanced Triss. Second it was Yennefer, and third time no one. <laughs> Everyone knows Triss is better anyway. That's debatable. Um, in The Witcher 3, maybe, but I don't know. I don't know. Overall, I think they're both bad. They're both bad. <laughs> they're not good choices, any of them. Dandelion Romance mod. A dandelion would I don't I don't like dandelion that way, but you know, still better. Still better. <laughs> sure there will be in a star and skin for which of these. <laughs> Dude, I would love that. But then again, you you know that I would. Um but then Did you know have you seen have you seen um the mod for Stardew Valley where you can have a star in as uh, he will be switched out with... Who is it again? I forgot his name. The one who lives by the beach. Yeah, so they... There's a mod where he has been switched out with um, a Starion. 
<laughs> so I have a feeling that a lot of games will have that modded in from now on. <laughs> but I think that's hilarious though. I think that's hilarious. <clears throat> But that would be that would be cool though. I have a feeling that it might what if what if you can mod Geralt to be a starion instead, you know? <laughs> You've seen it now? Did you just Google it? <laughs> uh, yeah, I was I was kinda tempted to play uh <laughs> Stardew Valley again just for that. <laughs> I would be lying if I didn't say that I was tempted because it's just I feel like Stardew Valley is a game that I... It's kind of endless, you know? And I played it for such a long time that I figured, you know, I don't, I don't know if I'll go back to this again. It needs to be very fresh, and I'm not really that into mods either. Mm, yes. Mod me into anything. Blood and wine. Astarian honey. Oh, la la. Mm. Oops, I farted. That's so loud! It, even my mic picks it up because it shows it like it, it starts playing on my, my speakers. <laughs> Palm is farts. Palm is obsessed with farts. Blood and wine, Astarian. That that would actually be very, very, very cool though. <laughs> what is it about you farts? Uh, but yeah, so maybe we should get into the game. We can do that. We can do that. Everyone loves farts. I, I'm not, not everyone then. I am not everyone then. Uh. But then again, I knew that. I knew that. You get that I can say it on the record. Why would I why would I care? I've said so many things on the record that I shouldn't have said. <laughs> As you well know. <laughs> why would I start lying now? <laughs> okay. Um yeah, I just need to make sure that it was enabled. <clears throat> yeah, I haven't played this, this since uh, April twentieth, and we 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 f uh, we became friends with uh, Hufsa. Oh yeah, controller. I can actually use my controller now. Our force can start to regrow now that the police officers are gone. Yeah, so what happens lo uh, happened last time was that, um, well, Hufsa was, was here, and she kind of chased us around. She wasn't dangerous. Well, I mean, she's, she's dangerous, but it's not because she... It's not intentional. It's just because she's very cold. So she just freezes everything. And then... And then... Stupid police officers ended up uh, burning down the whole forest for some reason. Um, so, Hifsa helped us uh, with the forest fire. Hedgehog, so yeah, the hedgehog is cute. <laughs> uh, but this game is cute though. I like it. I like the game. So let's see what's gonna happen now. We we're trying to find Moomin. A friend. We're trying to ha find a friend. So Moomin Troll went looking for the park keeper. Mm. At the, the 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 name for the we we call them Hotifnotto in Norwegian, and then Hadi Fadeners in in English just seems so it seems so weird. It seems so weird. Mm. 
Mm. Help Sniff find his lost friend. Oh yeah, that's the one at the beach. I mean, Papa's boat is missing. What can have happened to it? Hmm. The journey ahead is daunting, but with the promise of new experiences and unforgettable memories. <clears throat> yeah, so we have been to the beach already, but we didn't have a quest there. It's a flower. It's another flower. And another one. Another one. Wait, did I f How did- how- how do I switch- Okay. I think there was an easier way to switch the- Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how do I switch the- Oh, that- there we go. It's Y. Not that we have the right one anyway, but- Oh, we have the right one for these. Wait, hold on. Oh, they, they just died? No, they're sleeping. <laughs> they're sleeping. <laughs> this looks like ser serotonin in the game. Yeah, it is. it is really cute. Really cute and cozy. I should get to the Hattie Fadener's Island. We will. We will. Oh no. Yeah, chill out, B. Oh damn. Yeah, we gotta be careful. <gasps> it's a burb. Oh, the bird loves us. Oh. They nap. Yeah, they nap. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's okay. Uh, Snufkin's so fucking melodious. <laughs> They be mad if I remove these now. No, they don't care. They don't care. That's good. Hmm, am I supposed to push this over here? Perhaps, maybe. Oh, we got a shortcut. It's a Metroidvania now. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> I mean, I'm guessing we also get skills uh, upgraded era as we progress, you know? Maybe it is a Metroidvania. <laughs> Dark Souls of Movement. Mm. Hey, you're not allowed to be here. Okay. Okay. They're just sleeping. Yeah, so we don't have to worry about those again because we got a shortcut. Yeah, it is it is the Dark Souls of Moomin games. I mean, how many Moomin games are there in total? I, I don't know if I've seen... Oh, it's it's uh, this dude. I forgot his name. Looks like bad weather at the Hadi Fadener's Island. Hello, Two Tiki. Did you see who took Moo and Papa's boat? Two Tiki. What is the Norwegian name? I forgot what his name is. Mm -hmm. Stuffkin, a sight for sore eyes. Oh yes, it was your old friend Moo and Troll. Mm. He was looking for the park keeper. On the Hat of Adoners Island. I got a bad feeling about this. I should go after him. Huh. Hmm. A bit difficult without a boat, I reckon. Mm. Hmm. Uh huh. 
I guess I could help you build a raft, but I'd be needing some materials. Actually, I think it's a she. I don't think it's a he, if I remember correctly. It's been a while. Anything. What do you need? Huh? Three logs for the body. Uh -huh. A stick for the mast. Hmm. Some rope. Hmm. And some cloth for the sail. Logs, stick, rope, and cloth. Get right on it. <clears throat> Woman Papa's old boat is gone. Yes, it is. We played at least one, but it was like a hidden object game for kids. Hmm. Do you all know about bombs over there? Yeah. There was a comic uh, book as well at some point. But it's uh, it wasn't really something that I grew up with. It was more my siblings. I was a bit too young at the time. So the only reason why I knew about it was because my because of my siblings. The one with the blue hat and, and overalls, right? The invisible child. Oh no, he's back. Who's there? I can't see you. The invisible child? Her name was Nini, I think. Taken all I've got. I haven't taken anything. What do you what do you mean? Mm. Just because I'm invisible doesn't mean you can steal my clothes. Somebody stole from you? I can help. Bumps is a popular comic book as well as movies. There's a wild thing though. They made a Bumps a Game Boy game in 1993. It's in Swedish, of course, but still pretty wild. Damn, that is. Th I didn't know that. <laughs> there you are, I think. I am Snufkin. Hi. Oh, I thought you were stinky. For those of you who don't know, Stinky is, is not like she's not calling you Stinky in like the adjective. It, there's an actual character in the game called Stinky, <laughs> or like in in the universe called Stinky. Uh, I thought you were Stinky. Uh, stinky? That's not a compliment. Oh, I I ruined the I ruined the the surprise. I'm sorry. Of course, I see that you look different. I was just upset. I'm Nini. I remembered her name! I remembered her name! I'm Nini. Nice to meet you. Did Stinky steal your clothes? Why? Yes. He ran off with them while I was taking a swim. He said I didn't need them since I'm invisible. But I'm really cold. Stinky won't get away with this. I'll get your clothes back. See you soon. Um, I mean... I know what you mean. I know what you meant. <laughs> Aw. That was actually one... We had that on VHS. The episode where, where you meet Nini. Where... Um, she... Uh, there's something very memorable about that episode where they go and pick mushrooms. So they have these little baskets where they pick mushrooms in. <laughs> and just seeing her like invisible picking mushrooms is, is like a very clear image in my head. <laughs> you love Stinky. Mm. Stinky used to freak you out as a kid. <laughs> Wait, you watched this as a kid too, Chris? I didn't know that. 
Hmm. Oh, we can go here too. Oh, it's the the the, the this. I forgot what it was called. Wasn't there like a cave or something too? Oh, that was here. Oh, wait, no, maybe it wasn't here. But we don't have the right instrument though. Did you all know that Matt Berry's voice is Moomin Papa in the latest series? I had no idea. I don't know who voices anyone, to be honest, in 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 anything new, I don't think. It's pretty awesome. Wait, who is Matt Berry again? I know the name, but I can't place the, the, the face to the name. Need to rewatch it. Hmm. I the, you can't find them on YouTube. I watch them on YouTube with the Norwegian uh, dub, so I imagine that it's probably also possible to find it with English dub. Oh wait, wait, wait! Is it is it the? Um... Is it the 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 sea? No, wait. The 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 um, the boss or the son of the boss? No. Wait. Is it? The new boss, yeah, yeah, the, 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 <laughs> the, that, that makes it, yeah, now, then I understand why him voicing Moomin Papa then would be, uh, would be fun. <laughs> the son of the boss, yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna look for Sniff's friend, I guess. Magical mushrooms. I love the acoust uh, the ac um, acoustics. I don't know. I I can't I can't pronounce words today. It's not the first time. <laughs> I can't even say Lord of the Rings today. Well, now I could, but I couldn't earlier. <laughs> Yeah, the acoustics in this cave was was pretty good. <clears throat> oh, there's so many ways to go. It's a spooder friend. <gasps> Wait, you jumping on the spider? That's kind of rude. That's not very nice. Especially not when it's sleeping. Uh, didn't know pigeon noises don't echo? It's because acoustics. <laughs> the fact that I didn't know that you were about to tell a joke and I thought you were being serious. <laughs> Jumping on spiders. Not very nice. Are you gonna keep that joke? <laughs> uh. 
Oh. Yeah, I had a feeling that this would be the bad, uh, the, the the bad end. By the way, the 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 dead end. <laughs> I like these mushrooms. Sounds they make make me happy. And these are spiders. Are yeah, I guess I guess that's true. Also, I went to sleep with, like, wet hair, and it's so weird. <laughs> like, this this hair right here is just, like, a separate thing now from the rest of my hair. <laughs> it's not greasy, it's just, it's just, uh... <laughs> it's just being weird. This is a nice view. Look at that. love the mushrooms. Look at the, 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 the dolphins. I think they're dolphins. A piece of hair is gonna grow a new... <laughs> like a little mushroom on your head. Yeah. That's... That reminds me. I'm actually getting something in the mail. Uh, it was something that I, I pre-ordered a while ago. That is like one of those things you can attach to your... Uh, your headphones. So I'm gonna have a little leaf in the middle sticking up. <laughs> I I ordered a, a leaf, so I'm gonna have a leaf on my on my headphones. <laughs> oh no, we can't go back now. <gasps> it's a doggo. Oh, it's Cedric. That's who we're here for, <laughs> I guess. Oh, my dear Cedric, I'll never leave you again. Oh. What? You mean to tell me Cedric is a toy? Oh, he's a toy. I thought it was an actual dog. Oh, how rude. He's much more than a toy. Okay, then. Anyhow, we have to look for another way out now. Yes, this cave is awful, Snufkin. Get me out of here. <laughs> it's a toy. Okay. Uh, honestly, uh, Sniff is kind of a mood. I won't lie. I relate to Sniff sometimes. Cute, but but cute. Yeah. <laughs> like everyone has cat ears and stuff. No, no, no. I want a leaf. I want. I want a little sprout on my head, like my lurky moat. What is this? Gold! Oh. Treasure! Wait! Oh no. Oh, it's so beautiful. I don't see what's so special about it. <laughs> oh damn! No! No! <laughs> no! <laughs> Not Cedric! <laughs> Cedric. Uh. <laughs> Do something, Snuffkin. Cedric, please forgive me for dropping- I mean, losing you. <laughs> he doesn't oh. care. <laughs> oh, Cedric, how wonderful to have earned your forgiveness. <laughs> it is a mood, though. I was- uh, when I was a kid, I- I- I felt so bad in case my- my- my 
plushies fell on the floor or something or if someone threw them like don't throw him like he's gonna he's gonna get hurt <laughs> Hey, Veld! Time for crab. <laughs> but yeah, go, go, go give Chris a follow. Thank you for the shout out. I, I am terrible at shouting out people today, apparently. Well, not that there's been anyone else, but you know, still. <laughs> How you doing though, Veld? There, let's get out of the cave. But, but, the treasure? Do you want to risk losing Cedric again? Whoa. Uh... <laughs> oh. No, of course not. Help Sniff rescue his beloved Cedric. <laughs> Don't look at me like that, Cedric. Quest complete. Yeah. Leave, leave the poor crab to his treasure. Another crab's treasure. <laughs> it was it was another crab's treasure. That one took me too long to to piece together. <clears throat> Lauren does the same. <laughs> Maybe it's a neurodivergent thing. Who knows? Actually, I, I think it is. Um, I think I've actually heard that being a thing. <laughs> you're not too bad. Job searching is exhausting, though. Oh, you're looking for a new job? What? I mean, you you have been looking for a new job for a while, haven't you? But yeah, it it is. It is indeed. It's all connected. It's true. Sweet relief. That was close. Thank you so much for your help, Snufkin. You two stick together now. Wait. What's that, Cedric? Snufkin seems lonely, you say? Here, Snufkin. Cedric's wa uh, C Cedric wants you to have this companion. You might lack some of Cedric's charming uh, charm and impulsiveness, but... He's a structured and trustworthy fellow. Oh, thank you. Um, both of you. <gasps> Hemulin! It's Hemulin! A peculiar object that defies explanation. Wait, hold on. No. How do I open the thing again? Uh, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Uh, a peculiar object that defies explanation and logic. Hemulin is also one of the characters in, in the game. <laughs> He's the botanist that collects all the rare plants. Sedig wants me to thank you for saving us in the cave. Cedric and I were going through a rough patch, but you really helped us. Well, I'm glad I could help. I've been looking for a while, indeed. It's wild how companies keep complaining that they can't find any people while they still expect everyone to come work for them for barely more than minimum wage. Yeah, that's how it'd be. No one has enough money to buy all, all the stuff we need, but at the same time, they keep... Rising, uh, like increasing the prices on everything, and then the wage people make is just not matching things, like how how things work right now at all. It's not. It's not gonna last forever. That's for sure. Something's gonna happen. So where do we need to go now?
I guess we could go back to... Wait, did I need to do something with the... Oh! No. With the, um... The seaweed? I don't know. something. I don't know what though. I think this is where you went to the beach earlier. So this is not the way to go. Oh, that's what I heard. <gasps> you feel the inspiration flow through your body, enabling you to play even more heartfelt music. More creatures will respond to your... what... something. <laughs> something. You didn't let me finish reading. What's the problem? I got a terribly sore throat. Probably on account of this rope that's tied around my neck. Can you give me a hand? I promise I won't eat you or anything. It's not like I could swallow you anyway with this rope around my neck and all. That's reassuring. I'll see what I can do. Freedom. Thank you so much. Now please take that rope far away. Thanks. I'm sure it could be quite useful. I'm sure it could be. <gasps> Got an egg. Oh, we're gonna put it in the in the in the in the nest. All the eggs. But what are we supposed to do here? Are we gonna do anything else? Was this all it? Was this all? Generally, when people promise to not eat you, that's exactly what they're going to do. <laughs> Egg. Egg. Well, we we managed to avoid being eaten today. For now. This should be the way to the, the house. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Woo! Can we go into the house? <laughs> uh, I wonder how many people who come in here who knows where the egg command is from. There's a 92% chance Chris is a le legit degen. That that is true. <laughs> it is 100%. It's pre-pom. No, it's actually not pom. It is actually not. Because it is from The Witcher 3. It's from the Blood and Wine DLC. So it is from 2021. So you were, well, you were still here. Oh. 2021. Women troll at the Hadi Fadener's Island alone. Oh. Please find him, Snufkin. I don't like this at all. We'll find him. We'll find him. Don't you worry. Yeah, it was Orion who made that command, but it was on Nightbot, so I, I moved it over. <laughs> mm. 
This is where we came from, though, I think. Yeah, so there's no point in going this way. At least I don't think so. He could help us with that. <laughs> Stuffkin, did you meet Moomin Troll? It seems he's gone to the Hattie Fatterner's Island. <laughs> ah, it's got his sense of adventure for me. Don't be surprised if you find my boat there. Mm. Now come give an old fellow a hand. Team twerk. Also, we're getting an ad starting very soon. Like now. <laughs> this is the dream. <laughs> Chopping wood with moving papa. <laughs> I agree. I agree. Phew, what an ordeal. Thank you, Snufkin. <laughs> Please help yourself to some logs. Thanks a lot. I do need that. Now that's what I call a flawless log sawing technique. Yep, that is most definitely a cylindrical piece of timber. Have you found movement troll yet? Not yet, I'm afraid. Okay, so let's see what we have in our inventory now. Huh. Wait, we only got three? Okay, let's see. How, what was it that we needed? Get a piece of cloth from Ghost. Are we going to have to find a ghost? Get a long stick from Snork. Oh, that's... We haven't found them yet. <laughs> uh, I guess you're all degens here now. Chopping wood kind of sounds like farts. Let's see. Hmm, there's so many places we can't go because... Oh! So Stinky will be here, okay. Find the materials for two Tiki so that she can make you a raft. Okay, so it was a she. I, 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 I knew. I knew it. Find the materials for two Tiki so that she can make you a raft. Okay, so we need to go up here. And heal. Twitch be like, web school. Hey, Sarah, but you, you, I always start at seven. What do you mean? You can never trust Twitch. <laughs> but welcome back from the ads. Yeah, don't trust Twitch. Twitch, uh, Twitch be twitching. So Stinky will be here? Wait, hold on. But I can't get past here. Can't get past here. <laughs> Degen it up, yeah. Those are rookie numbers, you know. Hmm. Okay, 
Is this just straight up here? But how can I get past here, though? I guess we can, uh... <gasps> Wait, the, the police officers are gone? Okay, that helps. <gasps> it's a spooky ghost. Uh, hi. Aren't you afraid of me either? I'm sorry, no. Oh, that's so sad. I can't even scare a fly. But I'm not a fly. And I just keep getting smaller and smaller each time I fail to scare someone. Hmm. I think I can help you. You can? How? If we work together, I could try to bring some, uh, unsuspecting victims here. <laughs> oh. Lure the guards to the ghost to scare them out of the park. Okay. We can do that. You didn't pay attention to clock time because you were deeply engaged in some PS2. Wait, PS2? Really? Even 13 seems high. <laughs> Wait. What, what am I, how am I supposed to lure them over? Won't they catch me? Okay. Well, if I went that close, maybe I just need to make sure that I'm not that close. Okay. <laughs> oh, you got bigger! Okay, where's the ghost now? Unless you're in the same spot. You gotta split soon, got cats to sit on. No, don't don't sit on cats. Don't don't squish the cats. Oh, there you are. I'm trying to get your PS2 software into a PC emulator, it's a whole process. Hmm. Oh shit. Did you get bigger again? No, you didn't. Did you stop growing? Maybe you will grow again. There we go. Come here. I want to introduce you to someone. <laughs> oh, now you you big and spoopy. At least the emulating uh, is now legal. Is it? Yeah, I was like that. That doesn't sound like you. <laughs> but if it is, but then I guess I guess that explains it. We we're supposed to cat sit. Just just sit next to them. I think that's that's okay. I think you're allowed to, to just sit next to them. Yeah, I'm I'm here, okay? <laughs> it means sit like a cat. Mm. Because you're loading your own PS2 files into an emulator, it's basically your own PS2 but on PC. Mmm, I see. I see, I see. Okay. <gasps> we 
got rid of the park. <laughs> Woohoo, that was so much fun. Thank you, Snufkin. Don't mention it. That was truly my pleasure. Maybe you want my spare sheet of cloth. You can be a ghost like me. Ah, that cloth looks like it would be the perfect sail for our raft. Thank you. Yee! Yeah. Look at me! So scary! <laughs> very, 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 very scary. Very, very scary. Let's see. Hmm. We are gonna go up there. But I wanna see if there's any anything uh, else to do here. Oh. <gasps> I found some magic in the fern. This was not where I was supposed to go, by the way, but I just... <laughs> no, it was. I just I just took a different way. <gasps> it's me! What are you doing? Treasure hunting? I was called... I, I, people called me her when I was a kid. <laughs> I'm fin finding materials for two ticky. Suspicious, to say the least. I'll be keeping an eye on you. Thanks for leading me on a wild groke chase, by the way. <laughs> hey, Sodot, how you doing? How are you doing? Okay, so we just uh, took a detour, basically. What have you been up to, though, Sarah? And Sodot, what have you guys been up to today? Except the emulating thing, I mean. <gasps> what? Fish oil, fish, fish oil, fish oil, fish oil. Not chips. <laughs> oh, am I supposed to... Oh, it's a race. Am I supposed to race down... Here or something. I don't. I don't like that. <laughs> I don't like that. I don't. I don't want to be. I don't want anything timed. I want to chill. Are you good? I'm glad. I'm glad. It's a little race war. Yeah. I don't. I don't like that. Ah. Why am I walking so slowly through the fern? Today, just productivity stream. Food's now waiting for a certain crow to call you. A certain crow? I wonder who it might be. <laughs> but how my day? How has my day been? Eh, it's been okay. I've actually been to work today. But it was a very short day. Oh. Because, um, well, my boss didn't have any more work for me today, so I'm gonna, well, I, I work on Wednesdays anyway, but I usually don't work on Tuesdays, um, but I didn't work yesterday, so. So I, I s did not sleep very much, uh, last night, so I just went home, had something to eat, and then I took a nap. <laughs> And then I got ready for stream. Cookie Crow? Hmm. Could be, could be. <laughs> so today is a rainy day and you love it. You passed notes from your phone to the PC last night about a book idea you got last month. Ooh, that's interesting. Do you want to share something? I mean, I understand if you don't want to. But... 
<laughs> Naps are good. They are. They are. Huh. Hello, Snufkin. I'm playing a fun game for two. Mm -hmm. By myself. Oh. We're building a raft, and I was wondering if I could borrow that stick as a mast. Huh. Not unless you win against me in this enthralling game. Uh -huh. Which you won't. Hmm. What are, what are the rules? Mm -hmm. The first stick that makes it to those flags down there wins. Mm -hmm. Also, no laying your hands on the stick once the game is started. Uh -huh. You'll need to bring a stick of your own first. Uh -huh. Although, I doubt you find a stick as impressive as mine. <clears throat> well, we don't need to know about your stick, Snork. Alright, I'll be back. I find it. I see a stick right there. <laughs> Just an ordinary small stick. Not to be confused with the much more impressive long stick. <laughs> okay, if you say so. Ooh, what is this? Well, I wanted it to go all the way down here. Ah, oh, damn it. Oh, I could pick it up here. <laughs> Moomin Papa's masterpiece. A lifetime of profound ideas, emotions, and insights distilled into a few pages. Oh, I see, I see. Today I had to do some adulting, but later tonight you're gonna do define story structure and character arcs for the two main characters. Nice, nice. It's gonna be a character-driven fantasy about a mage who has perfect memory, but finds a woman who he can't remember even if she says that they spent a year in an adventure together. Interesting, interesting. That sounds pretty cool. Oh, what is this? Are we napping? <gasps> Pretty. We are napping. Taking a little breather. It's kind of like Kana and all the all the meditation spots that you can stop and just meditate at. <laughs> Kind of like that. This would be a dope BRB screen. It kind of would. Kind of would. It's cute. It is cute. Hmm. So I'm guessing the stick that we found is good enough. It's the only stick we found, so... I would imagine. I would imagine. Hmm? Oh, good, you found a stick. Mm -hmm. Do you want to begin? Um, sure. Wait, what? No! Why is mine so slow? Can I not sabotage him? <laughs> I feel like I should be able to sabotage him. <laughs> He's cheating. Oh, I can. Okay, nice. <laughs> okay.
I think we won pretty, pretty well. <laughs> wow, you won. My calculations are completely wrong. Well, I guess this is useless for me now. Here, you can have it. Thank you. Time for games. Easy. Easy. Go back to two ticky. Okay, so we got all, all the stuff we needed. Uh, and now they need to go on another year-long adventure and it's gonna be a bittersweet ending. It's a good ending, but not in a typical happy ever after type. Mm. I see. Don't give everything away, though. <laughs> You're excited? Mm. And now I'm cheating? Yeah, but he started it. <laughs> You're gonna be off now, Cat Sid and Alan Wake 2? Oh, it's the same place. Okay, yeah. Enjoy, enjoy, Palm. Hope you have a good. A good, a good cat sitting. Except no sitting on actual cats. Thank you for being here, Palm. Wait. Is this not where I was supposed to be? Oh, no, no. This is, uh, where Nini is. That's not the same spot. But it is. It's just down here. <laughs> uh. <Huh? laughs> My sense of direction in games is just awful. That's it. I can build you that raft now. Rafting it up. Hmm. That's it. This raft should hold up nicely. May the force be with you all. You too, you too, Palm. But the cat sit on you, it's only fair. Uh, mm, hmm. I don't know, I don't know. You're not saying anything about the story. <sighs> Magic system and plot twists. Hmm. No, 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 I mean, well, I don't know. <laughs> Do you need to figure out world lore deep in the magic system and create entirety? The entirety of Act 2A. <laughs> nice, nice. Mm. Yeah, I have to say, one of the most interesting thing for me when it comes to uh, fantasy is good world building. That makes all the difference. Just try to stay away from rough weather. Also, you should have this old map. It belonged to my grandfather. It's just been hanging on my wall. Hope it can help you navigate the Hadifadoners Island. <gasps> me? Aha! Going treasure hunting without me? I'm looking for Moomin Troll. That's clearly a treasure map. I'm coming with you. I'd prefer to travel alone. It might be dangerous. Trying to keep the treasure for yourself? You regret this. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm gonna sail out on the open ocean. <gasps> Pretty! Cute! Oh. <laughs> Thought you could cheat me out of the treasure? <laughs> oh no. Oh no! This is all your fault. What? You should be happy we made it in one piece. I sure hope Moomin Troll did the same. Hmm. Journey to the Hattie Fatterner's Island. Mm. 
But this is pretty though. Maybe we will find um, Hemulin here, uh, looking for exotic plants. <laughs> Moomin Troll. Where are you? Where indeed? Treasure, where are you? I need you to focus, Nufkin. I guess two heads work better than one. Depends on the heads. <laughs> the boat is missing a sail. I'll need that to get off the island. Right? Good world building makes everything feel alive and lived on, especially when it comes to more character-driven stories, since it deepens the understanding and con uh, connections between the reader and watcher with the story, alongside fully human feelings to tie everything together. Hmm. I think that was... <clears throat> I think that was why... Um, when it comes to... Uh, Frieren, why that one didn't impressed me that much because it didn't have a good world building. I, I noticed that right away. It felt so empty. Like the world felt so empty and they were traveling so much and when they travel a lot in a, in a show, I feel like they need good world building and it just, it was severely lacking for me there. So I think that's why I wasn't that invested in, in, in that show. So for me, it can really make or break a good fantasy story. It's really important. It is really important. This game looks pretty. So pretty. It is pretty. It is pretty. It's a Norwegian game too, by the way. Moomin Papa's boat. Sail is gone though. I'll get to that after I find Moomin Troll. You need to get your priorities straight. I'm claiming the treasure for myself. Good luck finding that dullard. I'm better off alone. Well, good luck then. <laughs> uh, good luck then. Moomin Troll must have gone this way. I don't have this instrument. I don't have this instrument. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. <laughs> Rumors say there's a pirate ship around here somewhere. <laughs> Interesting. If I only knew how to use monoculars, I could look for the treasure. I feel like this is the way that I need to go, so I'm gonna go this way instead and see if I can go up here? Oh, I can't. I can't. I just can't. Yeah, I love I love how it it's like hand hand painted and stuff. Well, I mean It's a pirate ship. It's a poor ship. A pirate ship. Could little me be right about the treasure? The ship is wrecked, but the sail seems intact. Maybe we could fix Moon Papa's boat with that. Maybe, maybe. <gasps> it's the Hardy Fighters over there. Gosh dang it. Fair, uh... Where's Violet Evergarden that makes Violet travel and the characters are rooted in the place they currently are in? Like the library up the mountain or the marriage of the two kingdoms or even the writer in the lake house? The place and their stories are tied to the characters within that place? I 
did not really think of Violet Evergarden as having good um, world building either. <laughs> but it didn't need to because it wasn't that... There wasn't that much traveling either. But I've also been very spoiled by my favorite anime, <laughs> which is Made in Abyss. And that is like top tier world building. So I like, I, I tend to compare everything to that. And I know that's not fair, but it's just so good. And obviously Lord of the Rings too. Like if, if you, you know, it's just amazing world building in those uh, pieces of fiction. You know that when, when you have a map of the world in the book or the manga, you know it's it's good. <laughs> well, not always good, but it's it's usually good. You're gonna have to watch Made in Abyss. Uh, then Lord of the Rings is a masterclass in world building. Mm -mm. Yeah, a good story like a story with good world building always has a map <laughs> I, I will i will say though made in abyss is um it's not for everyone though it is not for everyone look how pretty it is here <gasps> look at the flowers Yeah, uh, Made in Abyss has, it's like, it's about the abyss, right? But the way that they have made it, like the, such a huge part, if not like the biggest part of the entire story, it's like the abyss itself is its own character in the story. That's how good the world building is. <laughs> it's like, it's. It's a living, breathing character on its own. It's just, it's just so good. Is it worse than Madoka Magica in terms of not being for everyone? I have never... You're talking about... No, I, I mean, I haven't watched it, so I, I can't say. But it has been compared um, in terms that it like it looks very cute and stuff, and then it's not as cute as you think it's gonna be. Because I've heard that it has been compared in that sense, but I, I can't say because I never actually watched it. I've always been meaning to, but I, I kind of always forget. Look at these! It's the Hattie Fatterners. Fadern all, all of them. I don't like the English word for it. <laughs> it sounds wrong. <laughs> Oh, they're cute. Cute. I wanted one of these as a plushie. You can get it. You can get official uh, plushies of these as well. Okay, that doesn't look like the way forward up there. So we're gonna go there first. Oh, maybe it is. Never mind. I didn't see this platform. We'll see. Oh. Whoa. The same has happened with Made in Abyss uh, literally ever since it was coming out. Wait, what do you mean? Yeah, 
did you not like have well the moomin valley stuff is is uh it's pretty huge it's at least in uh in nordic countries um so it has a lot of merch it has a lot of merch You've been meaning to watch it, but forget. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Mm. Yeah, it's just... It, you can't really compare it to anything else. Like, anything else that I watched, I have not felt like I could compare it to anything. Uh, it's... Is that... me? In a barrel? Maybe. Is she a barrel rider now? Never mind. <laughs> a lifetime of profound ideas, emotions, and insights distilled into a few pages. But yeah, I mean... <sighs> The, the, the thing about Made in Abyss is that it's better to know as little as possible before watching it, because it will just make it better. <laughs> the footprints are leading this way. Mm. So, it's just, I just don't know how much I want to say, because it's better to know very little. But then it's like, I also don't know what you could consider being triggering to you, or if Because part of it is, like, not knowing when you get into it that it's not going to be that cute. But then it's, like, I feel like that's pretty common knowledge at this point if you are into anime. So, yeah. Uh, you remember it now? Uh, you've seen the merch and even once saw a cosplay with a plushie and it looks so pretty that you for some reason started studying, which is super unusual for you. Wait, what What was the, the cosplay? <laughs> it was the sound effect of him closing the, his mouth. <laughs> that was so funny. The treasure will soon be mine. I wonder what I'll buy with the treasure. <laughs> How's the treasure hunt going? How's not having any sense of adventure going? Yeah, see, this is this is why I was compared to her as a kid because because of her sass. I was a very sassy and rude kid. <laughs> I didn't I didn't mean to though. I was just I just. I just was. <gasps> it's a snake! Hold on. It looks similar to your character, or my character right now, but lots of plants and flowers and a plushie, and it was so colorful. Hmm. That's cute. I wonder when I get the the next instrument because I've seen so many of the I don't know if it's a drum or a tambourine it's kind of hard to tell that's the it's the that's the pirate afraid to get your feet wet typical land crab <laughs> try using the barrels to cross Okay, so I'm guessing this is where I need to go then. Which means that I need to go back to where the the snake was. Oh yeah. I should have I should look at the map more. Oh. Cute. No. 
I'm gonna push it. Nice. Good snack. Yeah, very good snack. <laughs> uh, let's see. <gasps> it's another one. Another one. Another one. No. Hmm. Ah, see if you can find more barrels. Okay. I see now. I see what you 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 mean. I like this game. It's cute. That's a cute game. Oh, if it isn't Snufkin here to relish in my misfortune. Wait. Is that 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 has to be that has to be uh Hemulin. Only he has such self pity. Oh no. It was it was not I mean, it was it was me. Aha, <laughs> uh -huh. uh -huh. finally here to help, are you? Have you found the treasure? I'm so close I can smell it. Oh that's just you. <laughs> okay, okay. It is really cute. Really love the music. I like it too. I like it too. Let's go up here. Oh, we can we can do the meditate. It, it's another meditation station. Ready? <gasps> Look at that! So pretty. It's- wait, you can't see it. Hold on. It's Moomin. It's the Moomin troll over here. At least it looks like it. Look at the stars. Yeah, I could- I could fall asleep to this. <laughs> I could fall asleep to that. So we, I think we've gotten all the barrels that we need. Maybe. Possibly. Yeah, we just need to release the river. Wait. I keep pressing the wrong button all the time. <laughs> I took a detour. I could have just gone down the the rope ladder, but even though when you don't get to see lots of stars, you really like going outside your house and just stare at the ones you get to see. Mm. Nicely done. Give it a few years. You could probably become a decent pirate. Hey, I don't need years. I could, I could do it easily now. How did you get here? Have you given up finding Moomin Troll? No. Have you? I mean, you weren't even looking for him, but... Poor Hattie Fatteners. Wait. 
There he is, Hamulan. I told you we would meet Hamulan here. <laughs> I had a feeling. Um, uh, please, the Hadi Fatterners need your help. I'm kind of on a mission already to find my friend Moomin Troll. <laughs> Moomin Troll, you say? He was just here to help me. Must have been unsuccessful though. I haven't seen him since. Uh, I haven't seen him since. Where did he go? Into the park to convince the park keeper to keep the bar uh, barometer back. To give the barom barometer back. Barometer? I don't understand anything. Hey, if you have watched Moomin, uh, Moomin Valley as a kid, or as an adult, uh, you know what this means. <laughs> I'm not gonna spoil it though, because you're, they're probably, pr probably gonna say in the game. I'm trying to keep up. The park keeper has built a hideous park in the middle of the Hadi Fatterner's territory. Locking their sacred barometer inside. Their totem. Their most precious item. It's been a while now, and Moomin Troll hasn't come back. Something must have happened. Moomin Troll? I'm coming to get you. Huh. And the barometer! <laughs> Sure, sure. We're gonna give the, the, the barometer back to the... To the little fellas. You looking forward to see what it means? <laughs> uh, yeah. They, they have, like... Uh, episodes... When they all travel to this island. As a family. Like, the whole Moomin family. And their friends. And then they get stuck here because of a storm. And, um... Yeah, let's just say that the barometer and the uh, the Hadi Fatterners, it's, it's a whole thing. <laughs> it's a whole thing. It's another pirate. Ah, they have dug up this entire area. Probably looking for treasure. No respect for professional pirates. How can you be a professional pirate? Isn't that kind of the point that you're you're not? Well, you know what I mean. I think. <laughs> Moomin Troll went in here, alone. <gasps> what are these? Bats? Are these bats? Hmm, I wonder if fireflies like music. Wait. Hmm. Remove all eight signs to get rid of the police officers and restore nature. Yes, we will. They are bats. <clears throat> hmm. I'm gonna make them fall asleep. shouldn't be in cages. No one should. Damn right. Damn right. We're hiding in the bushes. Maybe being paid by other pirates. <laughs> Damn butt indeed. Damn butt indeed. Ah, oh. uh, you saw nothing. <laughs> you saw nothing. <laughs> I'm too powerful. 
My flute is too powerful. That gate is locked. I need to find the key. Oh, I can't do it through the edge. That is unfortunate. <laughs> Easy. Easy. Need to get them closer. Ah, no. No, uh, get away from me, you rude man. see the point of that though but <laughs> do not come for butts cage. Thanks for asking. Just like all the other animals here. Anything I can do to help? Well, removing the park and freeing me would be a start. I've seen them hiding in objects beneath some of those hideous statues. I get the feeling it must be something important. interesting. Hmm. <gasps> Knock down every statue in every park. Go on, do it. Wait, is this the last park? Is that what you're saying? Must be the Hadi Fadener's barometer. Broken glass and signs of struggle. If the park keeper has touched as much as one hair on Moomin's troll's hairless head. Hmm. We did it. We did it. <gasps> Pretty. Yeah, now you have your um can't go that way. Too many howdy fatterners. Okay. But this way is okay. <laughs> okay. Hey. The howdy fatterners are reunited with their barometer. Finally. Take this drum as a symbol of my gratitude. He may help you with a local wildlife. See, now we got the, 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 the drum. 
Thank you. I've actually been looking for one. I, I actually have. <laughs> we got a drum. Wow, I need to track down movement troll. Yeah, you do. Well, yeah, we do. <gasps> Hello! Wait, hold on. I've just missed so many things. Because of I didn't have a drum. Frogo! Yeah, we got a frogo. A frogo friend. Gonna become one human band. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the, the thing about uh, Stuffkin is that he, well, you get you get the harmonica from the start, and that is like his instrument. He plays a lot of uh, harmonica. Hope you're better now. Do I know you? You all kind of look the same to me. Doesn't matter. Enjoy your freedom. You too. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Let's drum it up. Damn. We're pretty powerful. See, I guess I'm just meant to be a bard in games. I don't know what it is, but it's just, it's just, it's just how, it, it just makes games more fun if you can be a bard, you know? That was cute. Mm. <laughs> Moomin Troll went this way. I think he did, I think he did. What is this mysterious light? What can he be? What can he be? Oh, <gasps> pretty. Wait, no, they, the police, they, they captured Moomin. Moomin troll. Snuffkin, help me. By the power vested in me by myself, I'm taking you back for imprisonment in Moomin Valley. Hmm. Hmm. Did you see that? Yes, the park keeper just arrested poor Moomin Troll. Ah. Oh, not that. The pirate ship. You too, so. Enough of this pirate nonsense. I need to go after Moomin Troll. Somehow. Mm -hmm. <laughs> exactly. But Moomin Papa's boat is going nowhere without a sail. Also, that reminds me, I forgot that I had a... <laughs> I forgot that I had a story in here. <laughs> hey, Tusta. Exactly, but Moomin Papa's boat is going nowhere without a sail. Uh -huh. Luckily, there's a perfectly good sail on that pirate ship. Uh -huh. And most likely, a perfectly good treasure. So, how about we work together? It's a deal. It's a deal. It's your destiny. The world needs Vep the Bard. <laughs> they took Moomin Troll from us. We need to rescue our buddy. Yeah, we do. We do. That is also something that happens in, in like the, the show. Just don't slow me down, okay? Um, <clears throat> they capture m the Moomin Troll because they think he's an animal. Like he, they think he's a um, um, a hippo. So they put him in in a zoo. <laughs> Which is so rude. I wonder what that if that's what's gonna happen now. <laughs> uh. hmm. 
This looks heavy. I'm the brains of this operation. You're supposed to be the muscle. Let's see if we can find some help. So we're getting an ad. Uh, maybe you could have a look in this tiny cave. <laughs> I'm on it. You're too portly to fit in anyway. I guess that's true. It is rude. Movement all needs to be free. It's true. He does. He does. Oh! Oh! It's one of these dudes. It's a little dude. It's a little dude. <laughs> oh, Gobi, thank you for the 69 butt. <laughs> it cut off! <laughs> oh, let me do it again. Hey, Gobi, thank you for the 69 butts. Oh, Gobi, thank you for the 69 butts. But... <laughs> How you doing, Gobi? <laughs> it's Gobi. I didn't even think of the fact that I said that. <laughs> Can I have that as a walk on? <laughs> I I don't I don't know if you are a little dude, but maybe 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 you are now. Maybe you are now. Go be the little dude. <laughs> He's just a little dude. He's just a little dude. How are you doing though? Also, how how is everything going with the the moving and stuff? You here for it? <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm just not gonna do anything while there is an ad. By the way, <laughs> we're just we're just sitting here chatting. I wonder if if uh, Moomin is gonna be in a zoo when we get back. Could could happen. Could happen. Be good. You had to go to the U.S. Embassy in Lon uh, London this morning for an 8:30 a.m. appointment interview. Short version: Everything is now approved, and you can get the fuck out whenever you want. Oh, that's good. That's good that you got all the worst stuff over with now. At least I think. I think that's the case. <laughs> that's good. That is good. Woman in a zoo? Zoomin? <laughs> yeah, he's zoomin. <laughs> it's a okay, go, we can have a dance party then. Mm. Uh, I... I really need to make more emotes. I've been putting it off for so long. Well, it's not like it's not that I've been putting it off. It's more like I haven't really had time for it. You still gotta get married, so it depends on how you define worse stuff. Well, I mean, you chose it, so it can't be that bad. Um, <laughs> no one's forcing you, I'm guessing. <laughs> It's just a little dude. Probably need some more help. Wait, so you're not gonna push? Find more creeps, they're stronger than they look. Didn't me just call you a creep, Gobi? No, just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> uh, you love my emotes. Oh, thank you. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, I, I also just... I have a lot of ideas. <clears throat> it's just actually sitting down and, and doing something about it, you know? I feel like I have so little time.
Go be the creepy little dude. <laughs> we need to find more little dudes. We do. We do. We do indeed. Indeed, you do. There's a dude. A dee 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 dude dude little dude in in in. I mean, there were rocks, but I don't think I can climb with the rock. Can I? No. Because they're here. I only need one, probably. I probably only need one. Let's go get the, the last little dude. Hey! It's just a little dude again! Oh. Oh. Eee. Eee. There we go! Eee. Hey! Team to work! With Gobi and the little dudes. Two is good, just in case the first one runs away. <laughs> uh, how's life in Vepland? Feels like it's been forever since you caught a stream. Yeah, I feel like it has been a long time too. It's going, it's going okay though. Me too, Uh Well, I wasn't feeling good yesterday, so I've been at work today, which is unusual for me to, on a Tuesday. So I desperately needed a nap before stream. <laughs> so I've been napping. Been napping. Go be in the little dudes is the name of your rock band. <laughs> yeah, I mean. I'm just in a little bit of a weird spot mentally now. I tend to I tend to get into a depression when when uh when it's summertime or like spring. When it, I don't know, it's like I'm I'm complete opposite of everyone else. Like during winter time, I don't get depressed. But when summer comes, I get depressed. <laughs> um so I don't know. Movement troll, I'm coming to free you. Don't most people get that in a- yeah. Usually, yeah. I just- I- I don't. I've been like this since I was 14. At least that's the- the last- or the first time I remembered that happening. <laughs> I guess it just became a trend. It's too high to reach. Yeah, you're a bit on the short side. You want to talk. <laughs> Hold on. She's just sitting here. <laughs> Waiting for cuddles. Uh, I'm vitamin negative D. I take vitamin D every day. <laughs> I take like 80. I don't know how how, do, how what what measurement do they use because I don't think it's milligram. Maybe it is, and that's that should be more than enough. <laughs> Best stream ever. Yeah, she 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 is, she is very cuddly. She's just she's just hanging out. She's not a little dude. She she's just a, a little a little gal. Just a little gal. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> she she's cuddling my controller now. <laughs> hey. 
your stuff. Yeah, it's been so bright today that my lights are still not on. <laughs> it's kind of dark behind me. I've been seriously considering redecorating, moving my entire setup into uh, my spare room. Or switching bedrooms so I can have my setup in the room that I have my bedroom in right now. <laughs> That's a lot of work though, but... I just don't like how bright it is uh, during summertime in here. It doesn't work very well for streaming. <clears throat> Clearly, there's not enough sm smell still on that controller. <laughs> yeah. That's true. I think we need one more creep. Another little dude. Should I find a oh okay, okay. Fine. Come here. There we go. Do it, a change of scenery is so worth it. You did the same last week and you're still kinda of figuring it out, but so worth it. I used to have my setup in that room. Well, before then I had it where I have it now, and then I had it in in that room, and then I moved it back out here again because I ended up not spending time in my living room at all when I didn't have my PC here. Um, <laughs> so it's like, I feel like I can't win. <laughs> if the creeps want to cut, it's coming out of your part. Uh, okay. You were gonna ask if you had it in that room at one point. I did. Uh, I did. And it was because it was so bright in here. <laughs> I just, I feel like I can't find the perfect solution. Wait, is, oh, there she is. I was like, where, are you not coming with? We need to found Web Studios. That would be nice. Hey. <laughs> I'll be nice. <laughs> Let's see if we can find more creeps. So many creeps. So little time. It's okay, the best part of having multiple rooms is being able to use them whenever you want to instead of always having to use them all. Yeah, but then I end up not using the living room at all. <laughs> because I have no reason to. Oh, this this was so funny earlier. Look at him. Look at him now. <laughs> the sound effect when he just claps his jaw like that is just so funny. <laughs> It's another little dude. <clears throat> She's still being cute, cute, cutesta, cute, cutesta. <laughs> so many creeps, so little time putting on your Tinder profile. <laughs> Do it. Do it. I probably won't need another rock, but I'm, I'm bringing it with anyway. Where do we find another one? Oh, here. Hello. It's just another little dude. And you're not using the living room area as well right now. Yeah, and I feel bad. 
It makes me feel bad when I don't use the living room because like that's supposed to be the main room that you spend your time in, you know? As long as you're awake at least. So it just makes me feel bad. That's why I wanted to have everything in, in here because then I have my PC and my and my couch and my TV and everything in the same room. You know? The park keeper is going to get it. <laughs> is that you flirting, Snufkin? I can't- I, I'm not sure. He's like, he's gonna get it. <laughs> I know- I know what he means, though. I know what he means. Wait, I- I clipped through the- the- the mountain? We're in the mountain? We have become the mountain. Okay. You spend most of your time in the kitchen because that's where the fridge is? Wait, so you just stand in front of the fridge all day? <laughs> For you, it's just that your living room is just too damn hot? Mm. We are the mountain. Step on it? Why would you why would you want to step on the poor frogo? Wait. Why can't I push it any further? Oh, maybe this way. <laughs> maybe this way. Never ask for logic applied to your self-deprecating <laughs> But we you're not allowed to self-deprecate here. It's not okay. I don't do that. You want to have the fridge in your room for convenience sake? <laughs> hey, just get one of those uh, fridges you can have under the desk, you know? My fridge is too big to have under the desk. Oh, what a, what a, what a, what a. it's a barrel. It's a barrel. I guess I have to go all the way around? I'm too lazy for that. Even in games. <laughs> that, that is the command. That's what we needed to do. Congratulations, you saved a frog. Now can we get that treasure? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we gonna get it. Pirate cave. Oh, we're going into the cave. Uh, you feel the frog would have been okay in the water? <laughs> I think so too. I think so too. I actually bought some uh, storage stuff for my, my fridge today. I'm so tired of having, um, <clears throat> you know the the um, the drawers you have in the in the fridge to just have everything just loose in there because I tend to forget that I have certain things in the fridge and then it goes bad and then it starts leaking. <laughs> We're talking especially vegetables or fruits or something now. Um, it would just have it would just be nice to not have to pull out the entire drawer to clean it you know <laughs> look the treasure is probably inside here <clears throat> finders keepers I've done everything myself anyway sure you have <laughs> be careful oh 
Ah, uh, okay. She she died. <laughs> You're not a frogologist or anything? <laughs> frogologist. <clears throat> Mood? Yeah, yeah. What did we just say? I don't know. What did we just say? I feel like I said a lot of things. That didn't sound too good. Still, still, I'm coming. Stay, stay still. I'm coming for you. If you leave me to die and take the treasure for yourself, I'm coming back as a ghost to haunt you. See, me is kind of. I, I understand why people compare me to her as a kid. What you ended up doing was placing the fruits and veggies right in front of the door, so you need uh, you see them instead of putting them in the drawers. But if I have a lot of them, I don't have room for it in in the uh, there. <laughs> you know. Yeah, I bought some, um... I bought some stored stuff for the fridge. That will be very useful now. I've been wanting that for a long time. <laughs> so I got that chaotic good fridge. <laughs> Mine is just chaotic. Neutral, I guess. Because the bottom drawer, that's where you're supposed to store, like, meat and stuff. Because of the temperature. And then the middle one, there's not a lot of room there because of the, the, the racks where you put the bottles in. And then the top drawer, that's where I have all my my water and... And... Uh, and uh, my oat milk and... and uh, Ice coffee and stuff like that. All my all my drinks that aren't like too big. The bigger ones, the bottles, the bigger bottles, they go in the in the door. So not probably has milk in the lower door. Loose just sloshing around. <laughs> oh no, that's so awful. Especially because. Because milk. Milk is kind of gross, you know. Since you like eggs quite a bit, you put those in the drawers because you know you look for them. Also to use less cheese, you put them there too because you love cheese. <laughs> oh, little me's alright. Mm. I must say though, I enjoy the silence. You have milk in the main space with the water, but at some point you had it in the door. Mm. Poor bats. They're just trying to sleep. Look at the moon! Well, actually, you can't see it that well. Let's see. That's another cave. Uh, your fridge in the US uh, has a water dispenser in the door. You've been tempted to hook it up to the Pepsi Max instead. <laughs> hook, hook it up to Pepsi Max instead. Mm. <laughs> Look at the <laughs> You can't. The, <laughs> so the butt. <laughs> the butt. <laughs> Hold on. We, we 
kind of we we need to pin that. <laughs> It's a little turtle. It's a turtle, dude. It's a tood. Oh. Just sloshing around in the water. But I wanted to go on the other one, too. Oh, yeah, we can't- we can't leave yet. <laughs> Sloshing around like milk in Sonant's fridge. Mm. let me jump over there. <clears throat> oh, I can. I just need to... It was a bit finicky. We got it. butt and then the, the pleading pleading eyes so it all is pleading for the butt I, I guess that's not fair little me where are you I love the sound effects in this game. I like it. <gasps> it's a waterfall. Wait, can I go over there? I want to go over there. Are there any rocks? I guess I can't do it yet. We've all been there. <laughs> you have. <laughs> the irony of showing people your butt being called mooning is not lost. <laughs> Pleading for the butt sounds like it could be a song. <laughs> Maybe it is. Maybe there already is one. this <laughs> that reminds me I actually saw something interesting today uh, so I usually wear a specific brand uh, like a clothing brand not right now well I am but it's it's only my pants so you can't see it um, that I wear so often that Palm even made like <laughs> a sponsor uh, command for it. <laughs> and I've literally never seen anyone, anyone, not a single person uh, use the same brand. No one, until today. Okay, we're gonna go back here. Um, and it was when I was watching, well, I was, I was scrolling on TikTok and Suddenly I saw, uh, 
I don't remember his name, but there's like... So I follow... I follow a... A producer who... who like, a guitar player who's also a producer. And then he had a... A collab with someone. You probably know of a, a band called Polyphia. It's like the front man. I don't follow them. But I follow this other guy who who is uh, was collabing with them, and he was actually wearing one of their hoodies. I'm like, I've never seen anyone use this brand at all, and I thought it was pretty cool. I thought it was pretty cool. I do not remember what I just did down there. I didn't do anything down here. I said that I would go back. Um, and thought of mooning, you're right. <laughs> Wait, no, this is where I came from, isn't it? Jesus Christ, I'm so slow. I'm so slow. <laughs> See, I can't talk and play games at the same time. Because I literally have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, we need to go back then. Down here. Find my pants. Well, he was only wearing a hoodie. And it's not one of the hoodies that I have, but I recognize the brand because I wanted the same hoodie. For those of you who don't know what brand I'm talking about, I'm talking about Named Collective. It's a UK-based brand. And it's one of my most comfortable pieces of clothing. And it actually looks cool too. It's not just comfortable, it's also really good. Like, it's also really cool. So I need to wait. You know them? You do? Yeah, I wear them all the time. Like, all the time. <laughs> I have three pairs of pants from them and two tops. I even have two bikinis from them as well. I don't use them actually, but I, I do have them. And then I have... Two hoodies? Or is it three hoodies? I think at least I have two. But they're so good. Like, they're, they're not cheap though. But it's, it's so worth it because the quality is really good. You have some weird connections in the fashion industry. At one point you worked for a company that made websites for independent clothing and shoe manufacturers. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, because they're a really small company. Oh no, we can't return now. Hmm. It seems I'm stuck. What a surprise. Little me has to come to the rescue. <laughs> Thank you. I um I appreciate that. <laughs> See, that wasn't so difficult, was it? <laughs> now don't get all sentimental on me, or I'll regret not leaving you down there. <laughs> She's so annoying. Just like me. Yeah, I, I love Named Collective. It's it's such a good brand. If only I had enough money to just wear all of their clothes, though. Because there's so many that I haven't been able to get that I really want to. <gasps> it's the treasure! There it is! 
Oh, sweet treasure. My treasure. It's... It's... <gasps> Empty? Only a note? The treasure has been confiscated by the park keeper. What a piece of shit. I'm fuming. Me too. Me too. What a piece of shit. <clears throat> yeah. I, I was like, I have two different commit <laughs> sponsor commits because Palm has made them as a joke. I don't remember which one it is. Is it? I think sponsor is just it's just for fan gamer. <laughs> no, that is actually named collective. <laughs> Palm is so silly. <laughs> hmm. It hasn't been used in a while. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I've been I've been wearing their brand for like at least two or three years now, I think. The pirate ship and the sail is intact. Uh -huh. oh, I'm so happy that your wish came through uh, and came true. <laughs> we got it. Now we can go home. That's it. Let's go back to Moomin Papa's boat. Let's do it. Oh, that park keeper is going to get it all right. Don't don't say that. It sounds so sus. <laughs> it sounds so sus. <laughs> I'm guessing there's nothing else here. A little conch. Oh! Oh, it's a rock! It's a rock! I was hoping that we could go up there, but uh. Where's me? There she is. There she is! Have you ever seen anything as pretty? Oh, it's the... What's her name again? I forgot her name. A sight to behold. Hi there. How are you? <laughs> oh, I'm fabulous, as always. How can I not be when I know deep down that I am the most beautiful creature in existence? Well, I have to admire your confidence. I bet there's nothing in the world that can match my beauty. Really? Nothing? <laughs> Go ahead. I dare you to try to find something that equals my allure. I'll give it a try. Something pretty. Something pretty. Well, I'm sure we can find something. You'd say it. <laughs> you might be nice. No, stop it. That is not true. That is not true. That is a lie. It's a mirror. Both a functional tool for personal grooming as well as an ornate piece of art. Okay, so are we just gonna show her herself? Are we gonna be that disgustingly wholesome? <laughs> Woman Papa's boat. Let's see if the sail fits. Okay, we, we're gonna talk to her first and show her her face. How about this? Find something for the horse which rivals her beauty. 
Oh. Wow. <clears throat> this is the prettiest thing I've ever seen. Yes, it's quite a beautiful mirror. Huh? No! My reflection, of course. Oh. Now, if you wouldn't mind, I'd like some time alone to admire it. Oh, very well. Goodbye, then. <laughs> uh, you love disgustingly wholesome. It is often the truth. <laughs> often. Yeah, often it is. Perfect match. Ready to teach the parkkeeper a lesson? Uh -huh. Oh, yes. Let's get out of this treasureless swamp. I'm not entirely ready yet, because we didn't do this. <laughs> we didn't- we didn't have uh, the, the- the drum when we were here before. Oh. found it. It wasn't it wasn't that interesting. <laughs> it wasn't that interesting. I know we've been here before. I'm just trying to see if there's anything we have missed when it comes to the the drum stuff. I think I, I don't think there is anything else though. I think it was mostly here at the beginning. So let us move along. Mm. Was there anything back this way though? It doesn't seem like it. But you never know. Yeah, this is where we landed. Uh, or stranded. <laughs> landed, stranded, whatever. Close enough. Same, same. Just slightly different. Ready to sail back and uh, rescue Moomin Troll. The Moomin Troll. Ain't <coughs> hey, not fine. How you doing? I keep forgetting that you can actually run in this game. <laughs> I'm so tired today. Holy crap. Holy crepe. You just got home from work, you're exhausted. Huh. I feel that. Have you heard? The park keeper arrested Moomin Troll. Hmm. He's keeping him in his mansion east of here. I'll give him a piece of my mind. A treasure hoarding, Moomin kidnapping, no mannered meddler. Yeah, we'll show him. We'll show him. Uh, it's a sleepy day. Hey, clever. How you doing? Not fine real time clock. <laughs> real time clock. <laughs> uh, you had to buy a belt in honor of me? Wait, what do you mean? You had to buy a belt in honor of me? Wait, what? I never condone such a thing. 
belt? How disgusting. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Wait, are you talking about the tweet that I made? <clears throat> Is that what you're referring to? Oh, my tweet. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, I saw you message now. Everyone is here! <laughs> uh, what type of belt? That's the question, isn't it? Wait! Do you tend to show your butt crack to people in public? So, um, uh, not fine? Is that what you're trying to tell me? I'm glad you're trying to correct your mistakes, at least. That takes courage. Next time you see a guy with his crack out, drop a pencil down it. <laughs> Next butt you see a guy with a crack out, butt a pencil down. <laughs> it's a nice leather one with a fabric. Mm. You were cracked out at work today because your last belt broke. Oh, so it wasn't because of me. I see. Well, that's a relief. In the UK, you call that a builder's cleavage. <laughs> Here we call it a... Um, we actually have a... Um, <laughs> we call it a, a plumber crack. <laughs> it's, it's not even a joke. We call it a plumber crack. Directly translated. Uh, <laughs> plumber crack there too. You have that too, okay. Mm. Maybe I should check my map. Oh, we need to go over there. <clears throat> what is it in Norwegian? It's a uh, gurgle <laughs> That's what it is. Wait, this was not a, a harmonica before. Was it? I don't think so. <gasps> Mushroom! Your sister used to say the same, but with workers in general, to include plumbers. Hmm. Gurgly ghost. <laughs> No, hold on. <laughs> I'll type it out. <laughs> that's that's how it is. <laughs> sure it was. Sure it was. <laughs> oh. Oh no. I made it more angry by playing the drum. Oh. It's a it's a it's a little dude stuck in a tree. there. To Toffle? Or to Toffle? <laughs> oh, hello there, Wander. Hope I didn't disturb you. Can I help you with anything? Uh, it looks like you're the one in need of help. It yes, it would appear so. I'm, I'm sorry. How did you end up here? Oh, that's a long story. I got time. For me? Well, I left my lonely home searching for a friend. <laughs> then I found one. A potential, a potential one, at least. A message in a bottle. That's a start. <laughs> Miffle is her name. Miffle. 
But as it turns out, the world outside can be a scary place as well. Huh. Last night, I heard some horrible howling, so I fled up in this uh, this tree, oh. which seems to have upset these bees, and now I'm afraid to climb down. Hmm. Maybe I can try calming them down. <laughs> really? If it's not too much of a bother, we can give it a go. We did it! Go we get out of the tree, mate. <laughs> we love the little dudes, yeah. Yeah, the scrumpy want to crack it up. <laughs> Harry Potter and the bee bee philosopher stone. Mm. That's it. Go. Yeah, he kinda does have a a robe like outfit on, doesn't he? He's just missing the glasses. Dude, it's getting so dark. I should probably turn on some lights. Uh. There we go. Have cables. Well, that didn't help you guys, but it helped me. <laughs> <coughs> That's it. Go. Huh. I, uh... Huh. I... I can't. Why? Huh. I'm scared. Well... Then I guess you'll have to stay there. Huh. Perhaps that's the best. Huh. I'm safe here. Huh. I got nowhere to be. What about that... friend? Oh. Miffle? <laughs> she needs me. For Miffle. <laughs> For Miffle and beyond. You did it. <laughs> we did. We did it together. <laughs> yes, that's often easier. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. And now, to see my friend. I sure, I sure hope he finds that friend. Level up! We leveled up! <clears throat> no. Gobi. Don't do it. Don't do it. Let's see. Oh no. We need to calm the bees. Well, that's not a bee. I actually don't know what it is. It's 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 a bug of some kind. Well, this is sus. In case you were wondering, I'm walking around here because it gives me, uh, some, uh, sparkly stuff walking through the, the flowers and the bushes and stuff. <laughs> you know, I have to, I have to do it. It's a flying boop. It is a flying boop. Ah, the old theater. Such a pity it isn't being used anymore. Or is it? Maybe we need to go and check. Oh. I thought we could go in there. I guess not. I guess not. Isn't that where the horse used to be? The one we gave the mirror to? Didn't she perform there or something? Hmm. Need to make you play about butt spot. Oh damn. Hold it right there. 
Yes, do you have a permit for looking so suspicious? Imagine if you had a permit for looking suspicious. Is that a thing? Hmm. Huh, good one. Now where was I? <laughs> yes, no passage. Turn around. Okay. <clears throat> we'll find another way. <gasps> Verb! Verb. Yeah. The bird was headbanging. This is where we need to go, but we just need to find a different way in. Hey! It's a juniper! It's a juniper! Welcome in! <laughs> Welcome in! <laughs> Thank you so much for the raid! How was your stream? How was your stream? Uh, hold on, let me give you a shouty outy. Uh, go check out Juniper if you, if you, if you haven't already. You're playing mail time? Hey, Triz! Wait, what? <laughs> Welcome in! <laughs> Woo! Welcome in, guys! It's a double raid! It's a double raid! Let me give you a shout out, too! <laughs> welcome in, welcome in! Uh, you were playing Baldur's Gate 3? Nice! I'm also going to be playing Baldur's Gate 3 tomorrow. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Let me catch up. <clears throat> hey, Kukushi and Lady Irene. Welcome in. <laughs> and Juniper. Um, it's a you. It is a you. It is a you. And hi, Triz. <laughs> uh, and Kurumik. Kur 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 Wait. I, I'm so sorry. I am butchering your name, probably. Please tell me how, how to say your name so I don't say it wrong. <laughs> two raids now. We got two raids. Yeah. <laughs> but welcome in. Um, my name is Vepricos. I'm a Norwegian streamer. You can call me Vep or Vepri or Pia if you want to. Um, I'm currently playing Snufkin, which is... Something uh, like I grew up with a um, Moomin Valley uh, as a kid, so this is a uh, this is uh, this is very dear to my heart. So, and it's also a Norwegian game, so that's even even better, even better. So we're just chilling. We're having a cozy game time today. Uh, but you were playing Mail Time Juniper. I also play that on stream. How are you liking it? It's cozy. Cozy. We're all doing all the cozy coziness today. <clears throat> uh, just need new. Well, we don't need that. We don't need that. But uh... <laughs> oh, Kurumi. I can say Kurumi. I just, I just read it all in as one word, and that that was that was my uh... that was where I messed up. <laughs> I can say Kurumi though. <laughs> You finished it today. It was so lovely. Oh, did you have the party at the end and everything? There was a caterpillar who said you deserve prison. You'll never get over it. Oh, yeah. The, the caterpillar was so mean. I remember that, too. Yeah, the caterpillar was not nice. <laughs> good to hear. How are you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Welcome in. Also, hold on. Uh, I need to snooze the ad because we're about to get an ad. So we don't We don't want to... We don't want to... Um, Throw people into into an ad break as soon as they show up, you know. Um. <clears throat> <laughs> but you did. You got all the achievements. Nice. I missed one achievement in that game, and it bothered me so much because even when I started the game all over, it it was bugged out. That one achievement that I couldn't get was bugged out. <laughs> uh. But GG on finishing the game. Also. Triz, where were you? Are where are you in in the game right now? Where where are you in in Baldur's Gate? Uh, you probably had a raid message you didn't copy. 
<laughs> hey, Tom. <laughs> hey, Tom. Yeah, Tom only shows up whenever he's in a raid. He doesn't like me very much. No, I'm just, just joking. <laughs> I'm just joking. Uh, <laughs> you hate that for me? You had the problem in a different game, so you understand your pain. Yeah, it was. It, it's, it's so annoying, especially when you like getting achievements. Dude, it's so dark. Yeah, my hair is acting up today. I don't know what's going on. It looks greasy, but it's not. It's just... I just slept with my hair wet, so it, it just kind of separated. <laughs> it just kind of separated, you know? You know? I'm trying. <laughs> You're in the forge, I had one, the bugged part. Mm. I see, I see. Wait, are you talking about the golem? Mm. <laughs> Tom, no, don't leave. Don't leave. I shouldn't confront him about mini stolen clothes. Okay. Oh, I should confront. Yeah. I we we just met Stinky. This dude is well. This is Stinky, by the way. <laughs> hey, Amanda, how you doing? <clears throat> Separate hair is the best. Mm. <laughs> Come back, Tom. Hair looks nice. Always so regret sleeping on your hair when it's wet too. Yeah. My my hair is very curly. Um, it doesn't look like it is right now, but it is. Um, so it's a risky thing to do. Falling asleep with your hair wet. <laughs> I shouldn't do it. I shouldn't do it. Um, Golem, the bug bug's not done. Killed near last time. Oh oh, I'm sorry. I shouldn't wait. I, um, I'm 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 sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, I didn't mean to spoil anything. <laughs> it's just the only bug that I have encountered in 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 the forge. But it's optional though. Um, but you're doing good. Board at wa uh, work, waiting for the day to end. I feel that. I feel that. You also regret sleeping. Do you do you sleep though, Tom? Do you? Do you? You spend way too long trying to get through those dang polters. <laughs> hmm. The curls end up so sharp and bent. Yeah, they they do. They do. They the, the my hair was very interesting when I woke up. It's an optional bug. It's true. That's that's a good way of putting it, Gobi. <laughs> you have the memory of a goldfish. You probably won't remember. Hmm. Well, that's good though. That's well. In some cases, it's good. In other cases, maybe not. But in, in this case, it is good. <laughs> sometimes. Sometimes. Are you sure? You feel that time you took a nap and regretted it when it was time to go to bed. Yeah, I had a nap today, too. I'm still tired, though, so I think I'm, I think I'm good. But Stinky, what are you holding? Ah, just a new clothes I got. Those aren't yours. <laughs> Huh. As if I care. Catch me if you can. Oh no, I have to chase him now? Well, that wasn't... Is that a bra? No, it's a it's a bow. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> it was a bow. <laughs> it wasn't a bra. <laughs> Come on, Stinky. Give me the rest of the clothes. Never. Hey, we're gonna we're gonna get it eventually, okay? Oh fuck the stupid the the the, um, the ferns they they slow me down. <laughs> now nah, suck you up. Mm. Thief, speak for yourself. I'm no thief. Huh? I will never forgive you. I think I can live with that. I will. Oh, hi, he, he said that again. Yeah. So there's a, an invisible girl who was taking a bath in the ocean, and then Stinky stole her clothes. So we had to get them back. We had to get them back. <laughs> um, you might take a nap as well. Hey, a nap is really good. 
it's really good for the nap. <gasps> oh! Finally a place to rest my weary bones. <gasps> I mean, not permanently. Or perhaps. This is a good place as any. Sometimes I wonder if people can hear me think. Hey, I feel that. I feel that. Did I say that out loud? Probably not. Dude, I feel that too. Sometimes like, did I... S I could do with a bite though. Hello again. Mm. Oh, hello. Mm. I should probably invite you to sit. Mm. Is that an invitation? Oh, I'm sorry, we're having an ad. Uh, I, I don't do anything in the game while there's an ad, by the way. Hold on. Uh, this game looks cute. It is really cute. It is really cute. <laughs> You're gonna lurk as always while you get some stuff done. Hope you'll have a great stream. Thank you so much, Triz. I, if you, I don't know if you can hear me though, but <laughs> I should have, I should have read that before the ad. Um. <laughs> but yeah, anyone who was in a raid right now, uh, obviously do whatever you need to do. Take care of yourselves. Do some after stream care and all, all that stuff. Muskrat is not the guy who owns Twitter. <laughs> Elongated Muskrat. <laughs> yes. Yes, that's the one. Well, while there's an ad, I'm gonna I'm gonna put on some more lights because it's really dark here now. I also needed some more water because I'm almost out. I am almost out. <laughs> yeah, this got dark. Have you? Are you not familiar with the Moomin Valley? It is pretty dark. <laughs> I I had a lot of nightmares as a kid from watching this show. <laughs> It is, it is pretty dark. <laughs> you love the Moomins as it was called there when you were younger? I thought it was called Moomin Valley in English. But yeah, um... It was, it, this was my favorite show as a kid. Like, by, by far. Like, this was my absolute favorite as a kid. Um, so we had some of the episodes on, on VHS tapes as well. So I watched it a lot. I watched it a lot. You had some of the books too. Mm. Yeah, I think we also had a few of the books. But yeah. The ads are over, so let's go back to the game. Is that an invitation? Huh? I guess. So. Hmm. So. Huh. If I just had some chanterelles and a porcini, porcini, I could make a nice stew. Didn't I just put them in the, the, the pot? Huh? Perhaps you could get me some? Sure. The stew sounds lovely. Hmm. Oh, you want some too? All right. But I, I already gave it to you. Oh, unless you need even more. Damn, he's asking for a lot. Wait, what am I gonna do with the bee? Uh, oh, 
Oh, maybe over here. I see, I see. I see now. <clears throat> you can remember arguing with your mom that the author, Toby Jonsson, was clearly pronounced Jonsson and not... Jansson? Because it's clearly a J, not a Y. It's amazing that you know absolutely nothing when you're five. It's amazing. That you know absolutely everything when you're five. <laughs> Read that English, not Norwegian. I, 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 Jan, Jansen? Jan? Jansen? Well, yeah. Look at me. So scary. Yeah, um, yeah. I, I guess, I guess you're right. <laughs> The way I said it was correct, though. <laughs> Five-year-old Gobi. <laughs> not your real mom. <laughs> I hope not. Hmm. I believe I mentioned some mushrooms earlier. Please return once you have found some. Yeah, but don't I have mushrooms, though? Oh, I need to find one more shan uh, ch chanterelle. Okay, let's go find Ninny. <laughs> Yennefery. <laughs> hey, it's called. How? Well, I mean, you know, Yennefer. Well, that that was actually a poor example. Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> I should go to the park keeper's mansion. Umatol is there. I know, but we have other things we need to do as well. January. Yeah, I don't think we can go to where we need to go from here. <laughs> to the beach. But a different beach. That's a different beach. <laughs> it's this beach. Whoop. And now we can get some of the stuff that we couldn't before because we have the drum. Ocean gem evoking the majesty and power of the deep blue sea itself with its bold, salty something. Because I didn't get time to read it all. Anything can be a drum if you whack it a bunch. I guess. I guess that's true. I guess that's true. Okay, let's give Ninny her clothes back. Where you at? <gasps> Here you are. I think that was all of them. You. This was truly kind of you. My pleasure. And now I won't be stepping on your toes by mistake. Aww. Uh. Thanks for helping me out. Anytime. Aww. We did it. And we got an achievement. Um, <clears throat> salty licorice. Mm. <laughs> like your tongue. Uh, Procrust all the Chris tums. Mm. Your Chris's tum is a drum too. <laughs> Can ketchup be a drum? I guess. It's like that video of the seal giving their tum tum a right old bop. Mm. Right old bop. Indeed. 
You know what I used to do? I used to make uh, drum sounds with my navel. Like my belly button. Because it had like a, a nice like plopping sound. <laughs> it sounds so weird. Like if you hit it just right, it makes a, it, it makes a, a fun sound. <laughs> Anything is a drum if you're brave enough. Mm. Mm, we need to find a mushroom. I used to make drums out of my reasons. <laughs> Kobe, no. <laughs> oh, here it is. We found the mushroom. Okay, now we just need to find the dude again because I, I don't know. I don't know how I found him. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh wait, 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 wait. Did we? We have not climbed up here. There's a burb. It's Chris. It's Chris in the tree. So, oh, oh, it's the it's uh, it's Nook Perkins, um ankle belt, <laughs> as they call it. Um, You know that post on Discord that Palm put about stream lore? Uh, let's just pretend that I don't, uh, or that no one knows, because let's... You know... No one needs to know that. <laughs> Doing the... In the ear tonight, jump forward the pulley button. You know it. You know it. I got nettle. Hey, Cru I was gonna say Chris. Compose. How you doing? How you doing? Been here for a while, just lurking. Oh, I appreciate that. This game looks super cute. It is. It is really cute. It is really cute. I'll be doing well though. I'm gonna say the East Enders team, uh, team, by the way, theme, but that's probably too British. I know of the East Enders, but I never watched it, so I don't know the theme. Unless I know the theme, but I just know, don't know that it's from there. <laughs> but like, seriously, have none of you tried doing that? Have none of you tried playing playing sounds on on your belly button? I I highly doubt that that is true. Uh, I don't want to be here. <clears throat> you know what else is really cute? Everyone in this chat. True. Very true. That's a good point. What if you were hell diving hmm, without clever? Well, that's mean. I know you tried doing that uh, since you brought it up five minutes ago. It's been, it's been <laughs> I like that I have that influence on you, Gobi. <laughs> Not your belly button, but you do go pat, pat, pat. Mm. <laughs> this is the first time you've heard about belly button sounds, but you're so curious about it now. Yeah, if you just use one finger. So if you like, it's kind of like. I don't, I don't, I don't know how to explain it without showing it. I never, that's never going to happen. I will not show, only tell. 
But you just use one finger and you just hit, need to hit it right and it will be ni a, a, like a nice plopping sound. <laughs> Trust me. Yeah, and I also use the middle finger coping. <laughs> I like how we share technique. Yeah, the the middle finger is 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 the best uh, for that particular job. <laughs> well, she's busy. Hmm. <laughs> this is a wild topic of conversation. Really? It's not that wild. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Noted with the bell. I I can't say for sure. I think I don't think it matters. I think it works just as fine with or without the moist uh, ness. I don't know. Um, you you give it a go and you let me know how it goes. <laughs> And if you put your hands either side, you can alternate the fingers. <laughs> True. Yeah. You're gonna give it a go when you align your bed later. <laughs> when you're budding in bed later? Mm. We don't need to know that, though. <laughs> Reckon you're gonna try the thumb like slap piece. <laughs> Suppose you could create so a sort of pop sound with the right kind of suction. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> the moistness <coughs> affects the timber. I would I would Yeah, maybe it will. Maybe it will. Go be out here doing blast beats on his knee. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, fluff it. No, guys, remember. If this is new to you, I feel like I need to share this information with you guys. But you're not supposed to have fluff in there. You're supposed to clean your belly button when you shower, okay? I know it's a disgusting feeling, but you need to put some soap in there, you know, and get all the old... I feel like it shouldn't need to be said. But now I have. <laughs> I want to see what happened with the butt. I don't know. <laughs> Do do some experiments, Chris, and and tell us how it goes. Because I am I'm, uh, I don't know. I, I'm morbidly curious. Might be the 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 way I would put it. <laughs> You're playing the opening room to wipe out and having a blast. <laughs> uh, here you are. <clears throat> <laughs> oh, interrupting my thoughts once again. Thanks. I suppose they were getting a bit heavy. Hey, that's that's what we're trying to avoid. Talking about naval drumming and stuff, you know? <clears throat> you can't get too serious in here. That would be too, too... That would be, that would be a shame. <laughs> we're all scientists in our own way. <laughs> You do, it just builds up during the day. Hmm. Clean belly button is a happy, good sounding belly button. It's true, it's true, and you know when Gobi. No, uh, so dot. I mean, I hope you do. I, I, I don't know. I don't know. And belly button jumping helps clean out even more? It does? Hmm. See, it's good for more than one thing then. You know? You all. <laughs> belly button could tell you when he wasn't happy like maybe <laughs> Wait, <what>? whale. <laughs> what is going
going on here? <laughs> if you give it a mic, doesn't it count as a sad girl song? <laughs> Uh. So what's happening? You see, see, Snuffkin is also questioning this conversation. A lot of things are happening all over at any given time. Clearly, clearly. Um, you need to learn to be more specific. To be, be more specific. To be specific. What's happening with you right here, right now? I'm sitting here with an empty stomach. Waiting for you to make sense. Hmm. It's been a recurring theme in my life lately. Let's eat then. Hmm. Now you're making sense, thus actually solving two of my current problems. Hmm. With that out of the way, it's time to start worrying about the next meal. I'll do the thinking while you go looking for some nettle and por porcinis. Is it porcini or porcini? Porcini, porcini. <clears throat> I already had them. You sure took your time. Dude, I was literally right here. Holy crap. I think this dude wants me to punch him. Remember, always take some time out of your day to prioritize others. Like I'm doing. Feeding you all the time. Jesus Christ. Oh, thank you. I guess. <laughs> On that note, here are your ingredients. It seemed harder to come by than before. Hmm. Don't worry, you get your thanks. That uh, wasn't what I meant. Hmm. Then you should be more specific. It seems like nature is... Um... Hmm. Thank goodness the food is ready. <laughs> ah, I can feel my energy levels rising again. I wish I could say the same. You have taken a considerable amount of energy out of me with your troubles. As if I didn't have enough to worry about on my own. Hmm. I think I'd like to replenish my energy with some, uh, seaweed. I expect you want me to bring you some. Bingo. Hmm. You didn't want your belly button to quietly moan whilst you do it. <laughs> but here we are. Uh, the next Mitski's gonna be belly button? Oh no. <laughs> the butt is Krause's department. Mm. You said whale, which is, which is somewhat different from moan. That, that is That is a... Very important distinction, I would also say. Your belly button screeches like a skin. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yours is more like those screaming goats. Hey, as long as it's it doesn't sound like um I don't know why that was the first thing that popped into my head, but uh, a turtle mid action. You know, that would be hard <laughs> if your belly buttons up like that. <laughs> Have you heard those sounds? <laughs> uh, it's so funny because I was playing one of those hidden cat games and then they have some like different animals there too that if you find them they will like make different sounds and there there's literally a turtle when you click on it it makes the turtle orgasm sound I'm like <laughs> why why game <laughs> why It's just wrong. It's just wrong. And it's a perfectly innocent game too. It's not supposed to be funny or anything. It's just a supposedly wholesome game, but I guess that's the only sound that people know that turtles make. <laughs> I'm back with some seaweed. 
I suppose you want some wisdom in return. Luckily, as a wise philosopher once said, me, by the way, sharing wisdom does not diminish it. Plop, 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 plop. Yep, the middle finger is the best. I guess my speakers are loud right now <laughs> because my mic is picking up the, the speakers. <laughs> well, thank you for that, Gobi. Oh well, I guess you can have some of that as well. Just remember to pay it forward. Ah, thank you. My energy levels seem to be improving once again. How to get going now? Moomin Valley needs me. Moomin Valley needs all of us. Not just you, Snuffkin. Okay. <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. See you around, Muskrat. Holy crap. <gasps> Reach full stamina. You'll need it. Oh, I, I'll need it? Oh no, do I need to be chased again? Don't you dare say anything, Gobi. I know it's usually Palm, but I had a feeling that someone would say something. <laughs> so I'm just warning you. Uh, <laughs> but you love those hidden cat games. Mm, me too. I play them quite a lot when I just want to chill. I need to find orgasm turtle speedrun any percent. <laughs> what? Uh, there's a fantastic video where two tortoises decide to go right up to some hunting lions and just start going at it. You gotta have some serious nads to get frisky in front of some hunting lions. <laughs> uh, yeah. I'm, when when you when you when you're in the mood, you're in the mood, I suppose. I I I don't know. Ah, <laughs> uh, Jesus Christ. Okay, so. Uh, this is where we need to go, but... Oh, so we can go here. I see. I didn't think we could. Please release Moomin Troll. Wait. <gasps> it's Moomin Mama! She's sobbing. She do the sobbing. They better make sure Moomin Troll is warm in there, else... Oh, damn. The game's up. Hand over the treasure. And, uh, Moomin Troll, too. Hi, Moomin Troll. <laughs> Hi, little me. Snuffkin. Please, Mr. Parkkeeper. We just want our dear child back. Moomin Troll is being held on charges of vandalism and standing in the way of progress. There's nothing I can do now. I don't make the rules. Or, actually, I do. But rules are rules. Progress. Progress. You removed the river, destroyed nature, driven the animals out. You lack vision. Imagine this place when I get my irrigation system up. I'll bring water to all the parks. I'm building the valley of the future here. Enough. Release Moomin Troll, or else. Or else what? Well, you'll see. Oh, you'll find out. <laughs> <clears throat> Time to stop this madness once and for all. Uh, you like to imagine the tortoises had a conversation before. Hey, Margaret, you ever want to spice things up a bit? <laughs> hey, maybe they were just a bit, um... You know, a bit of an exhibitionistic couple. I don't know. You feel 
like you're destroying your childhood watching the movements and talking about turtle orgasms. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here, Snuffkin. I am. I am here. Snuffkin, do something. I am gonna do something. Insolence. That is me. Oh, Snuffkin. What can I do? I'm an artist. Not a fighter. I feel that. <gasps> Destroy the park keeper's garden. Of course I am. <laughs> Snuffkin. I missed you so much. How are you? I'm so much better now that I found you. Now, let's get you out of here. Mm. Oh dear, I'm afraid that might be difficult. Mm. You see, my cousin can be quite rigid when, he, rigid when he may, he's made up his mind. Don't worry, Moomin Troll. I'll find a way. <laughs> you always do. Yeah, go, go, go. Release your, 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 uh partner. Halt. Halt? There must be some way. Mm. My cousin, the park keeper, keeps the key to the prison guarded in his mansion at all times. Mm. However, he almost never leaves his house except when on official business. <laughs> or when he goes to see a play. Oh my, does he ever love theater? Hmm, the theater, you say. Snufkin, I have an idea. I can't tell you here. <laughs> but meet me by the old theater and I'll, I'll fill you in. I think I know what the plan is. And I like it. <clears throat> but you feel like you're destroying your childhood watching the movements talk about turtle orgasms. Stuff can do something precious to bang drum at a tree. <laughs> hey, it's the hippie way. You got filled in by the old theater ones. Why does everyone stand in the way of progress? If you stand in the way of progress, I'll have you arrested as well. Hey. No progress, only progress. Mmm, that key seems important. If only I could get the park keeper out. Mm. Can we go in, in the park now? No, we can't. Meet Moom and Papa by the theater. And we can go to the theater. Oh, damn. I'm just minding my own business. Oh. Mm -hmm. Progress, progress. Exactly. Exactly, Gobi. You get it. <clears throat> Snuffkin. I've done it. I come up with a masterful plan to free our dear Moomin Troll. That's great. So I'm guessing we're staging a pl mm. Please, Snuffkin, let Moomin Papa have this one. It's important to him. <laughs> Thanks, Moomin Mama. So my master plan is to put on a play to draw the. Ah. Quiet. I have an idea. We should put on a play to draw the parky. Mummy Papa was just in the middle of something. Let's give him this one. Oh. Great. Now I'll have to start all over. Anyway. <laughs> my master plan is to stage a great play to draw the park keeper out from his house. Brilliant. I could never have thought of that myself. <laughs> I'm in. What were you thinking, specifically? Well... We'll be needing a play. 
a written one, but it's blown all over Moon Valley. We'll be needing the old costumes. Last I heard, Philly, Philly, Philly Yonk. <laughs> In Norwegian, we call her Philly Fionka. <laughs> or Philly Fionk. Um. <clears throat> Last I heard, Philly Young was taking care of them. We'll scrape the old band together, but they'll need some rehearsing. And we'll need to hand out some invitations, including one to the park keeper. Hmm. If you think I'm doing all this by myself, you're out of your mind. Hmm. I made some invitations. Maybe you could help Snuffkin deliver them? <laughs> help him? I'm gonna raise him. Whoever delivers the invitations first is Moomin Troll's best friend. Ah, I see you haven't found all the pages of my masterpiece, but there's more than enough br brilliance in these to put up a play. Hmm. I haven't found all of them, but how do I, I've tried? Hmm. Great old band. I haven't seen them in a while. Let's hear how they do. That's it. It's coming together wonderfully. You're ready for the performance now. I wish I could be there, but I got to I got work to do. Practice with the band. Hmm. So I know there's not a whole lot of li uh, left of the game. The band sounds much better now, just like in the old days. Um. Uh, but I really can't finish it today, so I feel like I should. And now, before we're, like, so close to the end that it's, like, not worth doing on stream, you know what I mean? <laughs> <clears throat> and then we'll continue this again on Tuesday next week. And if we finish it, uh, like, pretty fast, if we finish it pretty fast, we can, we can start something else. Or I, I'm gonna switch over to, like... Hollow Knight, I think, because we still ha we still have the um, uh, Pale Court mod that I haven't returned to yet in in, in a while. So uh, we we're gonna we're gonna continue this on on Tuesday next week as well. And it's because Tuesday is the only day in the week that I can um, that I that I need to make sure that I don't stream for too long because I need to get up early the next day. So these cozy games you know it's nice and all but i can't be playing them for for uh, as long as i end up playing <laughs> Baldur's Gate 3 you know <laughs> uh it's a really cute and pretty game looking forward to next tuesday oh glad i'm glad also guys do not forget join the discord because we're gonna we're gonna have we're gonna be watching Lord of the Rings each Sunday now for the next three weeks. We're gonna watch Fellowship of the Ring this Sunday at 6 p.m. CEST. I think for EST that is like noon. Is it noon? I think it's noon. And uh, then we're gonna watch Two Towers the Sunday next, uh, like after that one. And then the Sunday after that one, we're gonna watch Return of the King. <clears throat> so it's gonna be it's gonna be all Lord of the Rings these next three Sundays so um don't don't forget to join if you want to watch if you want to come join us watch watch uh, the best movies ever made because sadly um it wasn't yesterday but it was the day before it was on the 5th, I think, where Bernard Hill, who plays um, King Theoden, 
passed away. So that would also be a good way to, to honor him, you know? Such a good actor. And he also played the captain in Titanic as well. For those who haven't watched Lord of the Rings, but have watched that Titanic. So that's what we're gonna do. That's what we're gonna do. Yeah, I don't think there's a whole lot left of the game, but it's gonna be enough for uh, like at least half a stream. We'll see. We'll see what, what, what will happen next Tuesday. He played the captain in Titanic as well. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Let me put on some music. But yeah, it's been it's been fun. It's been nice and chill and cozy playing this game. I really enjoy it. I really enjoy it. I hope you are too. I hope you are too. Um. <laughs> oh, my hair has been bo bothering me so much today. <laughs> uh, but also, I I will have to say, I, I'm I mean I. I'm trying to keep my stream shorter when I play Baldur's Gate three as well. It's just so difficult. <laughs> but tomorrow, I'm, I'm probably gonna try to... Well, last Baldur's Gate 3 stream was nine hours long, so we're gonna try to not keep it that long. That's what we're gonna do tomorrow. We're gonna be playing more Baldur's Gate 3, and we are at the end of Act 2. We just have, like, the... the main boss. <clears throat> I'm not going to spoil anything, but we we managed to, uh, I mean, I only gave the boss one try and it was, it was a little bit more difficult than I have uh, experienced before because we are playing on Tactician and I think it has like legendary uh, actions as well now and it was rough. So we gave it one try and then I gave up because I had been dreaming for so long. But we managed to talk our way out of first phase and I didn't know that was possible. So we skipped the entire first phase. That was interesting. I'm learning new things all the time in this game. Act 2 is so good because you can just talk your way out of fighting anything. Basically anything. Almost everything. <laughs> you just remember what happened last stream and it was amazing. You won't say anything else for others. Mm, that boss. Yeah, that boss. Uh, I just know because Triz was raiding in earlier and she is in Act 1 still. And I don't want to accidentally spoil more because I already did that when she was here. So I don't... <laughs> But that was wild, though. I didn't know you could uh, you could you could skip the the first phase. Uh, so that was fun. That was fun. Still difficult though because I died and I have I have only beaten this boss on the first try before. I haven't had to do it over again. So that that's I wasn't expecting it to be that difficult now. <laughs> but. We will do it. We're gonna beat him tomorrow. We're gonna beat him tomorrow. Beat his ass. Um, but yeah, so also I highly recommend people checking out my, my YouTube because I post all my VODs there. Uh, and I also post uh, shorts every day there as well as on TikTok um, and Instagram. I post the same ones on all the platforms just because I know that not everyone uses every single platform. So it's just, and also it depends on the algorithm is so weird that some, like the same clip can do really well on one platform, but really tank on a different one. So it's very interesting to, to post them on different ones to see which will do well on what platform <clears throat> because it varies so much. It's like the past week, I think, week and a half, I've had two reels no uh shorts on youtube that has gotten like eight and a half 
thousand views, <laughs> and then they have like two hundred views on on TikTok or or Instagram. I don't remember which one. So it's it's wild. It is wild how different it can be. Um, tomorrow shall be a glorious day, indeed. It will be. It will be because we will be entering Act Three. We will be entering Act Three. How things perform on different platforms is so interesting. It, it really is. <laughs> That's why I post every single day, because it doesn't really matter if you if you put a lot of work into making a good TikTok or short or reel or whatever, and then you post maybe once a week, and then you get really disappointed because it doesn't do well. If you post every day, you stop caring about whether something does well or not because <laughs> you post so often that you're just like, oh, well, let's try again tomorrow. Tomorrow's gonna be better, maybe. We'll see. <laughs> because the more you post, the less you care about how well it does. Uh, unless it does really well. But like, if it doesn't do well, you don't care as much. But if it does really well, then you care. So it's like, you can only win. At least that's how I feel. <laughs> So, and when it comes to, like, you're not supposed to care about these things, but obviously people do, you know? Sometimes things take a while to get picked up, like weeks later or something takes off. That's also true. That's also true. But hey, Marty, how you doing? How are you doing? Yeah, I... It's very interesting to see how well things go. Like, that's why I have very... Like, I don't put a lot of work into... Like, I I edit them, but I, like... I don't put a lot of work into making the content. Like, the content itself. Um, You know what I mean? So that's why I'm, like, I'm not... The threshold for, for posting something isn't that high. Uh... Because I know that it doesn't really matter in the end. Unfortunately, when it comes to short format, as I've said before, it's more about the quantity than the quality. <laughs> I know it shouldn't be that way, but that's how it is, unfortunately. And in some ways, it is kind of fortunate as well, because when you make... Uh, content for different platforms, it's nice to not have to put in so much work for every single platform. So, in a way, it's good. In a different way, it's not that good. <laughs> you know? Um, but good, how are you? Did you arrive for the end of the stream? Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Tuesday streams are usually shorter for me. Tuesdays are usually shorter streams for me because I need to get up early the next day. Um, we didn't finish the game though, but we're gonna finish it next Tuesday. So, I, I usually stream different- well, I tried to stream different games on Tuesdays. Uh, and then Baldur's Gate 3 on the other days. So. But uh, did you see, Marty? We're gonna be, go we're gonna be watching Lord of the Rings on Sunday. And then the Sunday after, and then the Sunday after that as well. <laughs> so we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna have movie night on Sunday. And, uh, yeah, so let's see if we can find someone to raid, though. Let's see if we can find someone to raid. You're not seen, but you're on Ven week and, um, weekend this weekend. Wait. You're on Van Weekend this weekend? Oh, I see, I see. But hey, we're gonna we're gonna do it every single Sunday for the next three weeks, though. So, if you miss this Sunday, you can still be there for the, the other two if you want to. So, we're just gonna watch The Fellowship of the Ring on Sunday, and then we're gonna watch Two Towers the next Sunday, and then The Return of the King the next Sunday after that as well. So... You're only missing one, then. It's gonna be- it, yeah, if you're in the Discord, it's in the announcements. Um, I only tag people who have uh, chosen the events. Um, the events 
role, so if you haven't chosen that, you can just go and check out the announcement channel to see the details if you want to. Uh, you'll definitely join some other Sunday. Just say hi this Sunday. Mm, I appreciate that. I hope you have a lovely time though, because you have you have worked hard for your your new van. So I hope you enjoy it. I hope you enjoy your time with the new van. Um, you excited for this Sunday? Me too. Me too. Also, if you want to join, this is the Discord. This is the Discord. Um, and um. Yeah, let's see if we can find someone to raid. I wish uh, I didn't have to end, but I, I kind of do. But uh, because... Well, you know. Early morning and all that stuff. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. If you're a bot, fuck off and don't join. Yeah, don't, don't, we don't, we don't want the bots. <laughs> the bots can, can, can get out of here. <laughs> Unless it's Streamlabs and, uh, well, sometimes butt spot. Sometimes butt spot can also fuck off. Most of the time it can. <laughs> Just notice I haven't started. Yeah, I haven't changed it. I haven't changed it. Um, it's just, it's just. You know, it makes sense. It makes sense. <laughs> um, Clever can have all the bots. Hope you get some good sleep. You too, Sarah. You too. Uh, only bots are choosing. Mm. No bots, only butts. Indeed, indeed. Thank you, stream. Hope you have a good rest. You too, Chris. Thank you. Let's see, who should we raid? What do you guys want to watch? Oh, what do you guys want to watch? I have like three people on right now who are playing uh, Baldur's Gate 3. <laughs> no, two, only two. I thought it was three. It's a 9 a.m. the movie night. I, th that depends on your time zone. <laughs> that depends on your time zone because it will show, it will show your local time in the announcements. Uh, so if you hover over it, it will show you the exact same time, like the exact time for you. But if you are in the U.S. and if you are in on the West Coast. If you're on the west coast, uh, it might actually be 9 a.m. <laughs> it might actually be 9 a.m. Uh, <laughs> because it's at 6 p.m. for me, so CEST, and that means that for EST, it's noon. Um, you're most likely gonna get some food now, so it can be anything for the raid. Mm. Moving on terms and conditions apply. <laughs> uh, you thought it was 9 a.m. Europe, which is, would not work, but no, 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 no. It, it is, it, I, I, it is definitely not 9 a.m. for me. <laughs> no, it's at 6 p.m. for me. Mm. Unfortunately, it's just difficult to find a good time for everyone because I also need to get up early the next day, and these movies are like three and a half hours long. So I figured streaming for, no, or showing it too late would also be too late for me. And then, you know, it's difficult to find a good time, but at least it's weekend. So more people have a chance to be there then, no matter what time it is. I found that surprising. <laughs> hmm. Let's see, you know, I kind of do want to raid someone who is playing uh, Baldur's Gate 3. Someone that I haven't, uh, well, I've raided her once and that was the first time that I found her stream because I was looking for someone new. 
which is something that I usually don't do, but she is in Act 3, and um, she just finished Astarian's questline last time that she was playing it, I think, and now she's at Sorceress Sundries. Um, she has finished that fight and everything, too. So we're gonna, we're gonna raid, we're gonna raid her. Is it Shell? No, I don't know who that is. Her name is Smidgen. Um... So that's who we're gonna raid. Uh... No, it's Smidgen. <laughs> And here's the raid message. Here's the other raid message. The first one is for subs. The second one is if you're not subbed. So you can copy whichever one uh, works for you. And this is what it's gonna look like if you are subbed, by the way. But yeah, I'll be back again tomorrow. We're gonna be playing some more Baldur's Gate 3. We are gonna finish Act 2. And that's gonna be cool. That's gonna be cool. And also make sure that you get, check out my socials. And it has my YouTube, my Instagram, my Twitter, my TikTok, um, and all, all kinds of stuff. So uh, check it out, check it out. I post all my vods on YouTube as well. I I'm ju I just need to make thumbnails for uh, my Snufkin playthroughs, and then I'm gonna start uploading those as well. But yeah, have a have a good have a good Tuesday. <laughs> have a good rest of your Tuesday, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye-bye.